Welcome back to Darkest Dungeon 2, everybody. We are now back on the main branch. The beta branch changes have been pushed. So we're going to keep going with our uh, highwayman and our grave robber here. Honestly, I'm kind of just willing to roll with them until they fall because they have been powerhouses lately with those bonus memories, not to mention the deadly positive quirk that we're hoping to be able to lock in here on CSA as soon as possible. Bringing out a combo squad, I think, for the most part today. We got an Exanimate Flagellant back in the mix, mostly just for the chance of the death fight again, or the death fight again, because I'm really looking forward to trying that out one more time. Warlock has returned once more. We're going to be trying a slightly different approach with this time around, opting for the Sacrificial Stab instead of the Chaotic Offering to try to generate that unchecked power. Should be good. The leaves fall, never to grow again. And for the YouTube bot viewers, I was just telling my Twitch chat here about the fact that I'm still excited about building you can teams like this. A change in the air. Just sitting at the stagecoach screen and considering the possibilities is still exciting. You see, even your valley even after is all not these years, the spreading stain. Let's see how we're going to be starting things off. So, Night Sworn, more than likely going to be wanting to. Oh, this, I knew I'd forgotten somebody, man. I forgot to set her skills because I was just going to say. Malaise most likely, measured and steady. we're going to be starting off quite a few of these combats with a repartee to generate both the stealth on the grave robber and the taunts on the flagellant. So, going to make sure we make that change once we get into the first end here. But uh, thankfully, we got a pretty damn good result all the same. Pretty much the targeting we were hoping for there. And managed to utilize the dodge, too. No stress to speak of, so that's pretty much ideal. This will be one unchecked power generated, at the very least. And a proof of concept for myself there, I guess. Spread it all around for funsies. There he goes. I'll, I'll get out of here with one. One less obstacle in our path. I'll very happily get out of here with one. Let's do it. Let's do it that way. I'm currently watching the YouTube VOD in the future. What are hover bikes like? Sweet reprieve. Until the next test is put before you. Y'all solved the climate crisis, right? We're good? We don't have to worry about it anymore? Cool. All right, right on. Oh, yeah. Skills. Don't instantly forget like usual. Repartee and then probably Dead of Night this time as well. Yeah, looks good. There's not a lot of shuffling going on this time around. We could rule out the crocodilian most the likely. This is a little worse for wear. Early bounty hunter but though. Familiar nonetheless. Ooh, and his rings applies a combo to attacker when missed. That's nice. Dead of Night skill adds two relics in a bottle. This is a wonderful thing to find early on. And all we have to do is avoid road fights. Our great cities burn. Baby. All that beauty and knowledge. Mm -hmm. Ash on the wind. So I'm thinking we'd probably go ahead and replace our highwayman this time around. Let's do that now. There is no man behind the hunter's mask. Pal! Only a terrible thought. Our guaranteed indelible trinket. And the unerring quirk, so... It would be best to swap his position here, but I'm not sure I'm going to be able to really do that. Have that, buddy. Even bigger bonus from combo here. Let's go with the uppercut. And finish him on this one. Got those set up. Good stuff. Let's get some food. Precious relics remind us of a time before the end. Infernal torch time, is it? I don't know, man. Are these little flame symbols meant to indicate, like, the difficulty level of the torch? Or what, what's... What's that mean? Yeah, I have yet to try any of these, huh? We could just call this run the Bastard's Beacon. Ah, damn it. Yeah, we can name the episode. No, for the, for the content, I guess. I'll try the Bastard's Beacon today. Enemies have a 100% chance to be ordained. Lair bosses are always ordained. Wandering bosses have increased chance to appear. I do like that. And then confession bosses gain unique buffs. Sure. Yeah. That sounds like fun. Honestly, that sounds like a good modifier. Interesting modifier. Can I go with the luxury gear today? 
which could mean who is that? That's the orphan wolf cub. Yeah, that doesn't seem like a bad idea to me. We can bring out Chubbs. It's been a minute since we brought out Chubbs. Anything that lets us travel further is worth the cost. This means one less name to draw, but hey, worth the sacrifice. Your coach must be maintained if it is to carry you where you must go. Buddy. It's official. Only death for those who would seek to stifle us. The bastard's beacon is lit. Aboard Thus. Our stagecoach for the day. Oh, come on in, Thus and Supersonic Seagull will join us. As our pal, Bounty Hunter. Eagle. There we go. Sweet. Mastery time. One learns quickly when survival demands it. We make the safety play there, and then I'm thinking probably Dead of Night's the way to go. Although we can wait to upgrade that until we are benefiting from it from the trinket, but I'm pretty sure it's a good idea to just go ahead and do it now anyway. And door would be a safe play. Let's do the let's do the super safe play. Yeah, that seems for the best. We're certainly going to be glad that we've got the bonuses to our relationship chances here, given the likelihood of triggering some toxic. We also have a wild tea that I might want to consider using right away. Although there's not really anything particularly bad. Get down to Coward, which would be nice, but also isn't really that big of a deal. Hey, Bear, the gods sent me a vision and blinded me from my hubris, but they did mention something about March 1st, but you know something about that. Thanks for reminding me to mention it to the YouTube Bob viewers. Yeah, I got a new album coming out, y'all. March 1st, book it on your calendar. Be Supreme, new album, Patience, coming to a music service near you. Music video and everything. It's going to be a, a full freaking production, baby. I'm doing stuff. Behold, the great cities of man, ruined and aflame. So NL finally recorded his verse. Ah, uh, no. So I, I, I might even have to just like put him on blast today. Like I'm not sweating it. I feel bad because I know people wanted it, but like, here's the, here's the, here's the nitty gritty. All right, I tried. I really did. We got close. We got to the point where I had a full verse written, we had a beat picked, and Ryan had begun working on his verse. The dude's got a kid. We had the we had those plans concocted prior to childbirth, I am fairly fairly sure. And you know, it was a lot easier to be ambitious about it back then. And then he had a newborn, and then obviously that got put on the back burner. And ever since then, it's been very difficult to raise it on the priority list. And I understand. I'm not upset in the least. Again, the only reason that I am concerned about it is because I feel bad because I told people that that would be a thing that we would do. I still hope it's a thing that we're going to do. I'm just unfortunately unable to delay what I'm doing anymore in order to try to make that happen. So, I'm still gonna try to make it a thing, just don't anticipate that we'll be able to do so. And clip. Measure out your violence and apply it judiciously. So we're bastard beacon in here, which means we're dealing with ordained folks way earlier than we uh, are typically used to here. Normally this would be the kind of squad that we're not super concerned about this early on. We're pretty pleased to have the uh, the strength in the build that we've got at the moment. The fiend's strength dwindles. But it's already pretty obvious that this is going to be... <laughs> a little bit more difficult than usual. I'm also very curious to see what those uh, unique benefits are going to be like. The, the things that result from the Bastards Beacon for the Confession Bosses. I'm, I'm excited to see po possibly maybe some unique skills or something like that. 
hole is split. Yeah, this bastard's beacon has got people doubting, dude, and I'm kind of into that. Maybe this is the spice we needed after all. Well, that was a heck of a heal there. Nice, bud. Okay, okay, let's see. Let's go ahead and keep that blight a piling. Nice big heal right back in business for him. Yeah, this is, uh, this is kind of rough. Obviously, it's going to get better as we go when we're more prepared for these sorts of encounters. The but at the moment, this is and wing. this is very difficult. We should be able to get an execute here, and we got another taunt up on the flagellum at least, not to mention the weakened. But I have an immediate respect for this. It's going to be tough. I want to keep that torch light up as much as possible as well. All right. It's an appropriately named beacon indeed, X, yeah. So, I went this way in an effort to avoid the barricade, and sure enough, we got another one on the other side. We have to avoid getting hit by six road army. battles. My Gathered God! In this dying land. The bastard's beacon indeed. His act demands tribute. His soul demands suffering. Just in time for the doubters to get in there. Okay, holy shit. This is terrifying. This is very, very bad. <laughs> I can't believe this happened. Oh, man. He's ordained, by the way. Here we go. Chubbs will save us. That's right. Chubbs has got our back. Oh, this is horrible. Holy fuck. Okay. Oh, God, what do I do? I think I have to get rid of the barricade. We're honestly kind of lucky that the barricade ended up being part of this, because it could have been a lot worse with another guy. That'll help. Okay. Bleed's not too bad. Obviously, we're very glad to have the flagellant here. Oh, boy. That's the bear lean right away. No kidding. That looks right. Malaise. Okay. Measured and steady. Yikes. All right, let's think. I don't think I need the heal here. Could go ahead and Welcome stab the, the barrier bear away. Pile. Is it all right for him to have the bleed? Pon Pon Pio. That's a fun name. Thanks for the prime. Welcome on into the pile. Appreciate it. Oh, this will hit this, won't it? No. He's guarded by the warlord. I see. Okay, okay, okay. Hmm. I want to take a chance on it not falling. I'm pretty sure we just go ahead and attempt some blight here, but he's got very high resistance. All right, that's pretty lucky. I think we got to go ahead and collect this bounty. Even the barricade's definitely going to help a lot. Oh, boy. Think of the bear house for him as well. Think of the brand new sub with the prime. Well, come on in. Keep it going. Get through those blocks somehow. Got to get this guy. He does not have... Oh, he's got Lash's Gift. That would be pretty solid. And then he could maybe get a decent heal from the coldest here. Let's give that a shot. Not bad. Okay, we're in there. Miss it. Okay, he's got a more and more, I think, coming up again. Stun chance. Not very good there, though. What if we get a mark for death in? Ooh. Eh, no, nah, that's not great. Let's just do that. This blight is thankful. Keeping the possibility alive of getting rid of this dude. Speaking of which. Oh boy, okay, that's not great. He's being very aggressive too. Normally he's much more interested in like combo and token generation. He's just going for the fucking throat now. Ooh, that's convenient. One down. Okay. Now just him. Paro crit's not all bad. 
Do I have one more tick of bleed for more and more? I feel like the stun chance is maybe worth going for here, especially because it's not getting much better than this, although... Eh, I mean, this is pretty good. <clears throat> Let's try it. All right, all right. Decent. Better chance for our blight here. Or no, this is an increased crit chance, but of course, better crit means better the blight. Weakens and wanes. Well, we still need to go for some heals. Oh, clutch. Occultist is playing the game right. Come on, Death's Door Flagellant. This is your moment to shine, buddy. Get rid of these negative tokens. Crit self-heal. Still got the bleed if we do that. Don't want to do anything that's going to damage him right now, though, so I suppose that's pretty much the only option. There remains a foothold out of this mire. That's pretty good. Now climb. Oh, God. Damn. All right, I feel like I got to go for it. That's big. Oh, man. Okay, we're... we're getting pretty lucky here, and even that has been barely enough to get by. Another Blight lands. Firebomb is not ideal, but did get the burn, so that's pretty good, too. Definitely do this again. Still got a bleed going. He might just have to go ahead and pass turn heal, although that's a chunk of damage right there, but yeah, this seems like the necessary play. Miss? Hey. Okay, that's good. Fight through the fatigue. Flame speed token, too. Not bad. Let's land another blight. Not that time. Okay, we're getting pretty lucky with that anyway, though. Let's go ahead and try to heal again. This is unreal performance out of the occultist, dude. JS Matt, on your first ever time being drawn, clutching it up. All Once right, again, we got to roll the dice again there, that. but we're Terrible hopeful. Nice. Wow. Speaking of clutch. Very, very good. Hit it again. Self-reliance is a rare and wonderful He's back. thing. With the dodge and the resistances. Oh, baby. No block for you, buddy. Burning stars. Crit time. Oh, shit. We're gaming. We're gaming, boys and girls. Warlord going down. Execution. Wow. That's crazy. Sweet reprieve. Until the next test is put before you. An appropriate reward. That was nuts. That's our banner now. Yeah, that's right. We wear that proudly. Get those in there. Get those in there. We go ahead and give the killing blow benefit to you, my friend. And then... Wow, that was fun. Again, the cult is just absolutely clutched there. She understands the futility of her work, but undertakes it nonetheless. That could have gone much, 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 much worse. No luxury gear this time. It's mostly what we're looking for. I think I'll go ahead and take up a salve or two to be safe. And some laudanum. There we go. I really don't mind the hospital there. Or an assistance encounter. We've come across one road fight so far, which is certainly nice. Definitely thinking about the possibility of a librarian fight here. I think we're pretty well suited for it. Although that fight just now has got me scared. Shouldn't let that happen. I right to be confident. We can do this. And that's a nice little uh, combat item to help us out with it too. Orientation. Steal your mind as this we pass through the void. Not a good time to set up a device. No, no. Sorry, Windows. I don't know when we agreed on that, but I, I, either you or I was mistaken. I really hope hitting dismiss on that doesn't this mean they interpret it as... Oh, so we should just go ahead and do it. And wretchedness. All right. Prepare yourself. Full reset incoming. Ah, oh, jeez. Okay, I think... Yeah, we gotta, gotta go ahead and not use glimmers here. 
certainly need the salves in the mix, so let's do this, and then that'll be for the best. Do we have Abyssal equipped? I do. Okay. Yeah, I think we, for the most part, have what we want to use here. Bounty Hunter's going to be marking for the most part. I mean, on paper, we have a really good team for this. The library burns. And with it, the remains of philosophy, reason, and insight. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Probably would have been a better play. Huh? Uh, new world. Well, oh, well. Fed, son. Thank you for the 15. Welcome on back to the fair pile bear hugs, please. So we're looking to try to get killing blows with our bounty hunter here. Because if we're able to do so, we're going to generate strength tokens on everybody behind him. Uh, I already got two taunts up, so let's go ahead and some tokens back there. Good. Can death show up in layers? Let's find out. Oh, God. That would be fun. And terrifying. Alright, got one lined up there. That hurt? Ew. God damn. 24 DOT. That is... That is brutal. Let's go ahead and try to get through that. Sets up. Oh, I was going to say an acid rainbow, but you definitely do that instead. Ooh, fun. Yeah, you can, you can go for it. That's a combo as well. Certainly not a bad idea. What road boss do you consider the worst to encounter? I, uh, well, if Chirurgeon counts, definitely that. That's been the thing that far and away has given me the most trouble lately. But Let second is probably the Warlord. Quickly. Especially Ordain. Like, again, we got an easier variant of that fight last time, too. We got a spiked barricade instead of another boy, which the more help he's got, the way or it, it's just crazy how much he can improve his teammates. Which I really like about that character, actually. I think it's really fun that he's got such a, a team-focused kit. Death, honestly, I don't think is that bad. I think Death might be one of the easier ones. Collector's not awful, either. Collector and Death are pretty doable. Yeah, I also think death could use a buff. Oh, flashing's on a cooldown now? That's weird. A miscalculation, perhaps. Forgot about that. Alright, strength for the squad. A little healing off that one. Death could use a buff. Put that on my tombstone. That's that's good. That's quality. Go ahead and endure a little bit here. Yeah, I think that's the play. Start controlling our stress a little better. And I want to get hit there, so. Your turn, buddy. Heal it up a little bit. Nice. God damn, man. Timed. This occultist is unaware of the potential of his class. And I don't intend to inform him. That's nice. We really need some big time help up front, though. I really do wish stun stop for a post, but I guess that'd be pretty strong. All right, do we endure again? I don't think so. Although we are certainly okay with prepping a toxic. Jeez, dude! Of trust. I'm starting to feel like I might just be able to bank on this guy. Oh yeah. The Securus heal? No, what's healing? Vanquisher, gain uh, gain five HP on killing blow. Wow, that's cool. If only he had to kill this to get the ultimate killing machine. Alrighty, there you go. Low in the back, very nice. Go ahead and mass rain that. Actually, let's do one more here. Yeah, that's what the best. We really are using up all our parallax early on on this one, man. We 
do need to avoid two points of stress here. I think it's fairly unlikely that these guys deal stress damage, though, so we shouldn't be too concerned about that. Nice stun there. Let's go ahead and smack him around a little more. And flashing time. Woo, baby. On to the next. That was fun. Should be able to get a killing blow here as well. Let's do it. Well, might as well just go for that one. Goddamn, Securus. It's not bad to give the block token up front either, actually. That works just as well. Yeah, flashing in this particular path with the Night Sworn. It requires stealth, but it hits the back three ranks, so it's a fun change for that skill. We resisted the stress big time on that move, but we very clearly have established who our next priority for death is. Holy Ordained Enemies is absolutely killer as well, man. It, it's pretty obvious the difference that makes in the first region. Incremental, but deadly all the same. No need to taunt any further. Don't mind that. And then big time damage there. Good stuff. Another Vanquisher heal. He's good to go. But effective. All right. The unabridged edition. We get the pot and still, which we've realized is one of the better stagecoach items, so that's pretty sick. And then another piece of luxury gear for the wolf cub. Tinderbox and smoldering hymnal. Smoldering hymnal's not bad, I guess. All right, we'll take it. Here we go. He teeters madly upon his ladder, reveling in the fiery destruction of Love human accomplishment. To see the unchecked power generate immediately, because we're going to want as much burning stars here as we can get. Obviously, not going to pull him forward, so I guess I should probably just go ahead and do the abyssal since I'm not going to affect the book stack there anyway. Ooh, generated the combo right away. That's pretty dope. Uh, I wouldn't mind doing this immediately either. Hey, that's not bad. Okay, and then. Let's take advantage of that Blight combo possible. Or uh, Blight crit possibility, I'm going to say. That's going to be a mark for death here. I don't think we necessarily need to use the Noisemakers just yet. Although, it probably wouldn't be a bad idea. Yeah, let's go for it. And then we can maybe do an Acid Rain this turn as well. Alright, he's already in Bounty Hunter's hit range, so that's pretty sick. This is unfortunately probably a meltdown for the bounty hunter, but if it's not, I should definitely go ahead and do that. A simple kind. That will prevent that and enable our toxic so that we got the taunt on the flagellant. He's already able to generate some life from that. Yeah, he should be in good shape. Ooh, is that gonna fuck us? Not even at all. Not a little. Well, kind of. Her being in this rank does mean we can't stab anymore, but we're definitely hoping to get more burning stars anyway. I don't want my repartee here. I'd also like to use this. Pull to clear a blind and also stun him. God damn, nice. All right, there we go. And then let's see. Let's probably go with the more Mori here to make damn sure these target, not to mention, get some healing out of that. Stun's huge. Hopefully get lucky with the firebomb. That time. I don't like how short the stacks are. That's got me nervous. Definitely need to do this. Boy, yeah, this is gonna be. Gonna have to get some life from the toxic, I think, and that's definitely not the start we wanna see there. Get some flame, speed, and strength. Okay, but he's already up to his front stack, and that's terrifying. Self a nice AoE hit, but that does trigger the blight for once. Thank you very much. Unlucky there, but we I expect it with the dodge. All I can do is heal. I need to move. He needs to be able to stab. We could do a noisemaker again here. He try to stun. His stun chance is actually fairly good. Yeah, that's even good. Hmm. I don't think I can. I don't think I can afford not to do that here, sadly, which is really shitty. Oh boy, and the smokestack blind crit. Wow, yeah, this is why I was pretty concerned about this. I don't, I don't like our odds here very much anymore. Uh, no vulnerable either, damn. No crit. Got the blight at least. Okay, yeah, this is already going pretty poorly though. I think I need to salve myself. That's an enormous burn. That's ridiculous. 
Plus I'm blind. You know what? Just heal. What buffs does he get from this flame? Oh, that's a good question. I think it's this. I think... Oh, he gets the buff from his trophy. That's cool. I hate it. And that's why we got so much burn from the smokestack. But that is neat. I like that... I like that mechanically. Oh, he's always had that? Really? That's crazy. I did not know that. Yeah, he seems to have a ton of HP. That was pretty clear from the jump. Okay, finally got a Burning Stars, but it's unfortunately with a blind and a dodge, so that's obviously not something I want to do. So let's instead do a salve here, and then heal up our boy with a 69. Nice. No bleed either, beautiful, but we are fucked. Unless we get resolute. Yeah, we're fucked. This is bad. This is very, very, very bad. It gets worse. This is no time to alter. Mm, man. Turns out, ordaining the lair boss. Yeah, it, uh, that hurts. That hurts a lot. Extinguished at last. I think we need to get the taunt up again and hope that the light can maybe bail us out, but it's probably not gonna happen. Mm -hmm. We need to land every single blight from here on up, and even then it's probably not gonna happen for us. Hey lucky. I'm not feeling super lucky here, but good to have you. Yeah, we're dead. Rip. And there's most of his HP back. Yikes. Still blind, are you kidding me? Well, there's all the occultist luck gone. All right, just in time. Wow, man, this is terrible. Stun certainly helps, but it's not gonna be enough. No way is this happening. Perhaps they have given that This last. is insane. Alright, maybe we don't need the bastard's beacon. <laughs> I'm glad to have tried it, but this is absurd. Darkness encroaches. Inexorable. This is why I was worried. And I was right to be. Yeah, we've learned here not to challenge the lair boss in region one. Death comes of a the rich uh, and poor alike. Of a bastard's beacon team. Oh man. I, get, I mean, whatever. Welcome. Doesn't even matter now. Bye bye. So fucking. Thank you for the 34. Welcome back. Toxikeel, clutching it. Watch this dude live out of spite. He did build up a pretty strong blight there, after all. A little too toxic. No blight that time, though. Yeah, fuck it. Self-reliance is a rare and Do wonderful best. thing. You got a crit. I was gonna say, if he doesn't take seven damage, then we only have one trigger, so let's try it. There he goes! <laughs> he would have done it too! Oh man. That was actually a lot closer than I expected. Over and over. Alright, let's rebuild. Until the truth is laid bare. And you are finally free. Let's go again. We'll probably do uh We travel through the incalculable dimensions. Of human weakness. Sorry, just checking in on the thing with Ryan. Uh, we might have to do chapter two instead, just to do something a little quicker here, so we can get it out of the way before we do our thing with Ryan today. Your sanctum 
adrift in this bituminous nightmare. So let's see if I can be a speedy bear and putting together our new squad. Pick me is open again if you'd like to be chosen. P-I-C-K-M-E in the chat. We'll put a new team together here. I understood here. your eagerness to build a reputation. And it pained me greatly to hold you back. The difficulty scaling for the non-mountain regions are now reversed since the enemies don't get more ordained, but you get more Across mastery. Right, yeah, yeah. A place between places. Yeah, I need to keep that in mind if I'm going to be doing that again, although I am pretty certain I'm not going to go that route. Ooh, a defiant duelist. Soft is unfortunate, but this definitely feels like something I should consider. Perfection glints wicked along the rapier's edge. Sneaky flagellant, a breacher runaway. Let's go. I'm all about that. Nothing remains. How, how absurd. A burning <laughs> will to Boisterous survive. as you should be. What a ridiculous character. And tough. Okay, hold on. Sorry, duelist. Making peace with adversity is the very essence of existence. Oh, man. Yeah, I forgot we had such a good Ravager Hellion, too. Holy shit. I have to bring them back out. No precision striker on him. Natural swing, Audrey. Interesting. And then unerring. Oh yeah, that's not bad. All right, let's bring the plague doctor out. Indiscriminate science stains the surgeon's hands. And let's see here. Reacher with crocodile. Ooh yeah, that's not a bad idea. Get something like this going. But then we would need him there, which means in the third slash second rank could be another grave robber with a natural swing specifically. Yeah, that's not the worst. Avarice slips unseen sure. into the catacombs of the mind. And you know what? I might even here. Let's let's have even, even more fun with it. Beneath bloodlust and fury. Yeah. There is emptiness. I like that. And shame. Our runaway is going to be in the orphan rank so that she can take full advantage of her bonus damage up front, which means she's going to be rocking the ransack. Likely the smoke screen, probably no cauterize this time around. We'll get the dragonfly, the fire starter, the searing strike. Yeah, there we go. Eh, I'll get cauterize in the mix just in case. I don't think I'm going to really need the ransack all that much. Well, then again, yeah, we'll just do that. There we go. That works. And then Grave Robber Audrey. We're going to go back to that Ninth Sworn path, I think, and then. Probably use the pick to the face this time around. Get the Dead of Night in there. Maybe have a Pirouette available if we need it. And then Repartee for the Hellion? I don't know if that's necessary this time, actually. I think we'll maybe just go without. We got the Dead of Night and the Stealth, anyway. There's going to have to be an Alchemist in the back for the bonus to the range skills. So we get the Noxious Blast and the Plague Grenade along with her heals. And probably Mag Rain this time around. And then that'll do it. Sweet. Who's coming along? Last call for the pick me. Let's draw four fresh faces for another go. The bastard's beacon question mark. Also, I guess it's only three given that we got one person returning here. Hyper Hedgehog of the team. Good to have you. Nemesaur joins the squad as our alchemist. Got to get their correct gear on, of course, as well. Go. And finally, Sal Kitty. Home of the team. Let's try our region two here with the bastard beacon. With a team that I think is going to be a little bit better suited for it too. But right, yeah, the biggest, the biggest lesson there: don't go for the region one layer boss because it's going to kick your ass. The road is yours to travel. But you are not alone. I think we were even, like, in a position where we, like, may have been able to do that. Comforts are exhausted. But. Ahead, only just not a trial smart. and tribulation. Just not a good idea. Let's just avoid it. You see, even your valley is not immune to the spreading stain. All right, so we're going to be starting with our breacher runaway here, which means I should probably go ahead and just toe-to-toe -to -toe right away? I don't know, actually. Do I want to dragonfly to begin with? I, I, I think maybe just use her damage. She's got the strength tokens, too, after all. Might as well take it. Yeah, having the bounty hunter, I suppose, was our best bet, too, wasn't it? That's a good point. Even that wasn't enough. I'm going to have to reconsider. So, yeah, I think we'll upgrade toe-to-toe -to -toe early on on this one. And then I won't mind having her in the second rank. That's why we upgraded her equipped cauterize. 
Librarian's the kind of the worst region one boss because it's a damage race. That's a fair point too, actually. Yeah, we might have been able the to handle something like a baby, but wanes. even that, I don't know. I just again, yeah, it was probably just a better idea not to even bother. Hiya, hiya is is I believe the the, the choice we'll make there. Yeah. A slow dissection. An unavoidable end. I guess that's why we have ransacked here. Okay, so this is all... This is all starting to come together. It definitely feels like the toe-to-toe -to -toe is the way to go for the upgrade. And I guess that's why we have the pirouette. This kind of feels like a crocodilian team, too, actually. All problems nice have their solutions. On. Even the big ones. Alright, off we go. Are you shaken? There is so much worse in store. I think we swap to Adrenaline Rush here as well. We get a big pig out of the game. Let's go. Rewarded for our ambition. Rest now for a time. Uh, I forgot I was excited to get his rings on that last run too. Oh well. Oh, here we go. Yeah, Leviathan Region 1. That's the route to go. Certainly that'll go well. The farms and fields of our kingdom overrun with putrescence and rot. Another big pig. An icebox as well. Table loom, tinker's bench, the iron regime. Which one likes the road gear? That's the slime. Eh, I don't know if that's that big of a deal. I kind of want to go crocodilian here. The breacher, of course, is immediately nice. I'm gonna snag it. A nominal pittance. Jackson! Gifted sub to Nemesaur. Welcome on into the team. And into the pile. Give us some bear hugs, please. Appreciate it. Bastard's Beacon. Doing it again. Which means I'm grabbing some salves for safety. Let's make sure I don't forget to feed them. Oh, hold on. We're gonna bring a bounty hunter out, aren't we? And I think that's gonna replace our grave robber. There is no man behind the hunter's mask. Oh, baby. Only a terrible oh, no. thought. Kittens. Lethal faint kill list bounty hunter. Who's that gonna be? That's El Grim. Another fitting name. Hyper Hedgehog with the Jackson Gifty. Welcome into the pile as well. Appreciate it. Thank you. You go ahead and take those gnarly knuckles too, buddy. Make sure you're getting as much damage as possible. And then I might actually consider the early harvest child here after that kind of luck, dude. Big pig? I mean, we got two of them. Nah, it's a bit of a waste without the grave robber in the mix. Experience, however painful, is the greatest teacher of all. And let's do the safety yield. Cool. Okay. Slap on the crocodilian. Each improvement. A new variable in the equation of your fate. Red, green, left, right is definitely the name of our stagecoach. I believe that's one I've done before. If not, it's a perfect fit. And Plump Pug the second, another name that I feel fairly sure we've had on the roster, but is a great fit as well. Some sometimes Mubot just knows best. Let's get in there. This ought to be a pretty solid squad now. But is it enough to convince me to go the fool's route of the region one lair boss again? The rancid crop grows unchecked and abhorrent. All right. Oh boy, yeah, never mind. <laughs> I said that before realizing it was literally the first node. No, thanks. We're good. We're going to hit the watchtower. I'd rather this run go beyond the first region here. The loathing whispers. Uh, we got to... I mean, sadly, it's not a very good use of the bounty hunter, obviously, to avoid the lair, but... That was a bad decision. We spent the whole, like, past 15 minutes describing that as a bad choice. I'm, like, I'm not about to make it. I know that seems like my typical M.O., but... Sometimes I can be smart. Or at least pretend. See, look, I took the free stuff. 
Seems intelligent. Just had the worst luck ever in my last run. The loathing festers. After barely winning a general fight, and then had a shambler encounter with no option not to fight it. Yikes. Sometimes they just sign their own warrants, huh? Add themselves to the kill list. The Wainwright awaits, eager to ply his trade. Huge! Wow! Fantastic loot. A couple of adrenaline tonics, some holy water, and the hint of home. Telescope's not bad either. Your collection can wait. Press onward. What's a high man weigh about a hundred pounds? That's a, that's a tiny high man. A little baby boy. I'm always kind of weirded out by that until I remember, oh yeah, she's a breacher. And then I giggle to myself, oh yeah, she's a breacher, that's weird. Alright, her blight chance is still insanely high, despite the uh, area we find ourselves in here. He's skinny because he's really tall. He's a high man, I understand. I understand. Let's see. We smoke screen that. We're probably gonna wanna try to searing strike a lot. Although, I'm beginning to wonder if toe-to-toe -to -toe is actually the play because we wanna keep her in the front as much as possible. That was unfortunate. Definitely don't mind her taking the brunt of the damage either. Let's see. Let's get a big burn going there. Still plus 20%, so it's significant at least. There's a plus three, baby. Even if we're not going after the lair boss, still fun to pile on the kill list bonuses. Speaking of which, let's go ahead and keep weakening here. That means he's keeping his blind, right? All right, that's fine with me. Lay it even further, and then let's go like that. Where I suppose we want to ransack in the mix, and then we got a big light there as well. Great combo, beautiful. He's weakened toe to toe to clear the winded, and add this little bit of damage there, bring him down to two. No problem. Here's the regen, beautiful. Another one down. Yeah, you just go ahead and miss for me, K-Pal. Hey, now. You need to listen better, friend. That is not right. This is what you need to do. There you go. Just fall to pieces. Cut down these nightmares Ooh. and blaze the trail to your redemption. Not bad, not bad. Slot this in right here. Yeah, loss of 4 HP is not a problem. Nice. I do you think we could take on the Chirurgeon here? I think that's a fitting use of our Bounty Hunter in this position. Let's see. Ooh, big disagreement here. A little bit of stress. This lowers our torch light, which is obviously not ideal. We don't want to pay though at that precious amount of relics. I think we're just gonna have to fight this man, just take the negative relationship hit. This does add to our kill list, possibly, too, at least. Magrain! Just a casual permanent plus 9% damage bonus. It's, it's far and away the best trinket in the game. Nerfed only by the fact that only he can wield it. Imagine that on any other character. It's just, it's, it's not even close how much better that is than anything else. Good old regen, baby. Just a bit of disease there. That's nice that the regen popped up front, too. Damn. Can't resist it all, I guess. It's not a terrible one, though. Even considering upgrading her smoke screen again here, and wings. despite the fact that I anticipated her being a little bit more aggressive, seems like she'd still benefit from that. Let's let the bounty hunter help 
hopefully finish this guy off. Oh, my, not too much. Miss it. Ow. The stress is kind of piling up here, too. I'm going to equip a revelry soon. Another plus 3%. Early results are encouraging. Is kill list all that good if they're DOT driven? Yeah. Still. Absolutely. It's that good. I would still very happily go for the kill list on the Plague Doctor, for example. Like, that could still potentially be really nice. Oh, I gotta remember I got Crocodilian here, too, man. I do tend to forget that, which makes me wonder if it's ever as worth it as I think it is. Oh, she's just dead. I guess that's fine, though. Holy shit. That'll do. That'll do. Malaise. Yikes. Measured and steady. Unfortunate. Oh, she's got the death armor here, too. Okay, so we might just have to go for the execute on that, which is fine. I should probably do this. And then we're going to smoke screen again here, so we don't have to worry about this so much. Got her down to death's door for the week in there. That's nice. So much stress, though. Oh, boy. Don't hit her. Thank you. And, yeah, we definitely need to find our way to the raucous revelry here. Another one down. Bringing them up to 18 or 21 or something like that. No, 15. I'm a little... Ambitious. A calculated generosity, but a welcome one nonetheless. There we go, buddy. There we go, pal. Let me just cauterize the funsies. Let him get the execute. Good stuff. Hey, Ace. Sadly, I already lost the squad today, but. An inkling of potency right still back lingers in, in some of these well-worn relics. With a team that definitely feels more than capable of going the distance. Bear, would you play a randomizer mod for Beauty 2? All skills reshuffle between rosters. All trinkets are universal and lots of specific skills. Enemies from different regions reshuffled and encounters. Random boss at the end. Ah! The loathing festers. I've never been super into randomizers in general I wouldn't I wouldn't expect it to be honest so I got some pretty good stuff for this I am worried about it as I think I should be this could very well just be another early exit god even the bounty hunter doesn't want to do it dude ill fortune to waste blood and meat Huh. I mean, we're going to be even further in the dark, pal, if we do this. My instincts are screaming at me to run away. I'm going to listen to him. The loathing howls. I don't think this is a good idea. Thankfully, the loathing is going to be held in check. We also get back-to-back -back assistance encounters here to uh, assist our torchlight situation. We've already got a couple of mastery points out of this region, too. Or, well, we will in a second. Although, I'm going to need more help than that. The scout doesn't really matter that much, but I'd rather avoid the negative pip. Yeah, no big deal there. So I'm looking for food on the next one. Pretty quick region. What did the hospital successfully, so be grabbing the medical equipment there too. Avoid the loathing check, avoid a meltdown here, hopefully. And we still have to get through the rampart. Alright, not too bad, not too bad. Remember the Spelunky randomizer? That was fun. Yeah, I mean, it was good for a day. But even that, like, I, I saw that and I expected to be more into it than I was. And then trying it, I just sort of got tired of it a lot more quickly than I expected to. So, yeah, I don't really want to force it. The interest isn't there. The 
was half, half expecting the Warlord again for this. Alright, Breacher, do your thing. I love the mag in here, too. This shit, this should just be a guaranteed burn, man. Come on, seriously. What is with you? Fuck off! Goddamn barriers cheating, dude. Let's see, we got a crit potential? No, they're all way too strong, so... Let's do this, I guess. Yeah, welcome, Corp. Good to have you. What's new on beta branch compared to vanilla? Well, we're back on the main branch now, actually. The main reason we were on the beta branch last week was because they had the uh, adjustments to the grave robber and the highwayman paths, which are fairly significant and difficult to summarize. Suffice it to say, they, they have been adjusted significantly. We're going to need to cauterize that. Taking some attention off her for a second. Wait, that bounty, buddy. Well done. And, well, maybe we just let her take care of herself. The taunt up, anyway. And we definitely need to revelry now. I don't know why I haven't done that up at this point. There remains a foothold out of this mire. Does she have lowered healing? Now climb. No, it's just what we heal for, apparently. I thought it would be way more than that. Okay, that's kind of concerning. We might even be able to heal off the DOT hit. Not quite, but it's definitely still the play. That feels so good. Palpable relief. Yeah, she doesn't like that. Okay. Well, you know what? Neither of you get a heal then. How about that? If you're going to throw a fit like that, you're going to be upset when your teammate gets some support. No, that's not great. I guess we're salving. MF Sutri! Thank you for the prime. Brand new member of the pile. There's another one today. Thank Relief you guys very much. In these times. Good to have you. Appreciate the Save support. It. Oh, boy. All right. Well, that guy's dead. That's fine. No, ha or, uh, no revelry this time. Just go ahead and clear the wind again. Need another taunt anyway. Really don't want to get the meltdown here. Can we heal you? Yes. Give him some bear hugs, please, for the brand new subscription. Uh, Phoenix new Magician. Welcome back. A few for them, too. Thank you for the two months. Welcome back in. Good to have you. Oh, it feels so nice. Okay, let's set this up. We really don't want to be vulnerable, huh? All right. This road cannot be walked alone. They're getting better, baby. And this is making me feel like I probably want to go ahead and upgrade Revelry, too. Clearly going to need it. Ooh, the attempted bear hugs. Guess what that gets you? That gets you a gift sub, buddy. Come on in. Get them the bear hugs. And then do we stall this? I think so. Well, uh, maybe the Hellion won't have another shot, but at least we should give it a try. Doesn't look like it. That's okay, though. Maybe sneak in another heal or something. Nope. Good enough. Better off, anyway. Sweet reprieve. Ooh. Until the next test is put before you. What's well, laudanum? And those powders are gonna be good for later when we get the grave robber back. Neat. Very excited for this Hellion to have those uh, knuckles at some point too. He's gonna be a powerhouse. All right, I already made it here. Looks like we're good to go. Let's do it. Further reinforcing my belief that this quirk can actually be good on any character. And if Runaway can do it, who can't? Malaise, measured and steady. Though we are obviously yet again concerned about our stress situation here. I'd like to smokescreen you. 
likely prevent any further stress being added onto her at the moment. Clearly got a revelry. And then hopefully be able to get a little laudanum in on her as well. We should be good after that. Let's see. Let's yank him forward. Perfect. Ideally forcing a rush judgment crit here. We get at least one. Ideally two. Who's first action? Ah, oh, front one. That stinks. I'm pretty happy with a dragonfly here, but this would be pretty good too. Let's focus on the altar for now. Make sure that thing's taken care of. Oh, big time miss there. That's going to lead to a rush judgment crit. Nice. Let's go ahead and land him again. A simple kindness. And hmm, could consider this. Oh, that's even better. Yeah, that's outstanding. We have essentially fully negated the effectiveness of these two enemies now. That is really nice. Yeah, let's go ahead and clear the wind at it. I suppose our kill list doesn't really matter anymore, does it? Yeah, we're pretty much just looking to slaughter these dudes now. So let's do it. A breakthrough. Very close. He's dead on the blight. There's a slick little brisk bedevilment in there. Sadly, that doesn't mean she's up there for the... Uh, Proper attack again. We get a nice little stress heal off that, though. And then I think this dude's dead. Ooh, he's got the regen now. Shit. Gonna have to play a grenade that or something. I guess we can just do this. That'll solve it. Blind it here. Not too bad. Regen 2. Good stuff. And then she's gonna be rushed judgment for a couple turns now. No concern there. And I don't mind that one bit, although that is going to be blocked, isn't it? So instead, let's just clear the block. And once she adds on one more stress point there, we'll go for the, the revelry again. Variable can make all the difference. It's all in on you. Uh, cauterize? I don't think it's necessary. Let's DOT going. No worries, no worries. Back-to-back -back rush judgment. Oh, this is beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Get it! Oh, yeah! Ravager's back, baby. Get another kill list bonus for no reason. A simple variable. Easily resolved. Just rubbing it in. Keep her in the third rank for the rush. An unavoidable end. Oh, my Hellion back up. She's good to go. And even revelry one more time just for the thrill of it. Just for goofs. The crit mark, my god, a stress heal off that too. Yeah, then let's throw a party. We're having a good time. Knock one down, why not? And there it's right back to you, okay. We need to heal. Let's get her killed. We had our goofs, we had our we had our fun. Big damage, buddy. This is for all the marbles. What you got? Show me your potential. There it is. He sure freaking did. Goodbye. Sweat-soaked brows. Unsteady stances. Mm -hmm. Exhaustion takes hold. An excellent finish. In this world, wealth is worthless Ooh, without baby. purpose. baby, in the best possible trinket. Snap judgment. The loathing festers. Outstanding. And instantly give this to our speedy runaway. Who's going to be loving life. We need to get rid of that Hemic Rod eventually. Hell yeah, man. Well played, Grim. That's in good shape to begin this one. Maybe we can handle the Bastard's Beacon after all. Rest tonight under the mountain's unblinking gaze. Swine Slayer. Well, I know where that means we gotta go. Some of that sluice. Consider your position hmm. and plan accordingly. Ooh, triple academics cash is seen no more. Our great cities burn. All that beauty and knowledge. Hmm. Ash on the wind. Yet another big pig is ridiculous. 
so desperately wish we could afford this. We're one bobble away. I gotta check these things before I repair the coach. God damn it. All right, but pretty tremendous relationship benefits here, actually. Hold on, let me see if the songbook's gonna be as good as I think it is. It is. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. We're gonna get ourselves into a really nice relationship position early fair, on here. But fairly priced. Give me all of that. Wow. Plus four. Plus two. Yes, sir. Plus threes. Max affinity. Holy shit. Holy shit. Give him the big pig. Bon vivant. Max affinity. Are you kidding me? This is a ridiculously good situation for this early on. I got a couple of whiskey flasks I can use even. Let's max out Plague Doctor Runaway. Why the heck not? My goodness. Relationships fully maxed out on the Plague Doctor. That's pretty great. Time to master. The means of mastery. I'm thinking Howling End here. Getting an enormous amount of damage from that skill, and then... I was thinking about Smokescreen. Dragonfly would be pretty strong as well. Hmm. Oh, let's do Rockus. Yeah, that's a safety play. Alright, man. Moving on. Anything we want to get out of here? I kind of want to... Considering the Sharpness Charm. Oh yeah, we do have these uh, trinkets to swap out now as well. Don't need that thing anymore. Grave Robber will love the Snap Judgment. Yeah, I think that's probably best for her. And then let's do that. Cool. Yeah, I think this is a good idea to get to. Snag this and then give that to you. You are just ridiculous right now. And let's get the hint of home to her since she's going to be getting hit a lot with the Breacher. Oh, look at that. Pretty damn good outcome. I think I'll buy a salve if we got one available. Or not. That works. Alright, let's do it. Hit the sprawl, baby. Uh -huh. All positive, let's go. Aspiration unites the hopeful. Revelry with an additional stress heal. Poison dart with stress heal too. Stress heal from play grenade, nice. Very hopeful team. Hopeful for that revenge, huh? Play grenade and noxious blast will stress heal. Cauterize, too. Wow. Very nice. Uh, at this point, they're the same, I believe, Link. Uh, the beta just got pushed to the main branch. Behold. The great cities of man. Oh, God. Ruined. And a flame. Quick pull mods do we seek our revenge against the librarian do we risk another early exit let the pile decide what do I gotta choose now I guess I can just go this way yeah that's fine Get our prediction going we can run the poll in the prediction at the same time right I think so. I am beginning to lean closer to just going for it, yeah. Although sadly we did lose our armor just then. Emboldened anarchists. Desperate to exercise their nihilism. Precision striker granting us a crit to start this off. This is an elite fight. Okay, I think this is gonna give me a good idea of how confident I should be going into this encounter. A good test. Let's see. I like play grenade. This big blade in the back. Okay. Do I have repertoire equipped? I should. I hope I do. This team's gonna be tough. Yeah, this is gonna be a very good test because this is a very difficult squad to beat. 
Oh, that's a risky play, but I want to try it. Hey, wow, okay. That's a good start. I'll get Pirouette into a toe-to-toe -to -toe there if I want. I can also go for the Poison Dart play. It's a stress heal either way, but I think this is for the best. Although, ooh, flashing is available if I go with a shimmering too. I want to hang on to that. Yeah, we might even get a pirouette out of this too, since we're getting snap judgment speed. Seems likely, in fact. Ag rain, very unlikely to hit. So let's go for the flight. Malaise, measured and steady. Okay. okay. Pirouette time. Through the dodge, got ourselves some more crocodilian damage. That's a big burn. Wow, thank goodness for the regen there. Holy shit. Let's try a burn, I guess. It's fairly unlikely again, but big damage at least. The bear optimal. Weakened here. Hopefully the runaway is able to survive back to back hits. That's what's coming. Oh, all right. That's lucky. Yeah, I definitely needed to get the toe-to-toe -to -toe taunts up there anyway. That is a uh, dead boy up front. Yeah, clearly, the enemy is quite capable of hitting our weak targets. Great effect. Yeah, dude. Oh, boy. Burns are getting real nasty. Persistence will overcome even the greatest of threats. We're able to focus the big guy well enough, but it came to the cost of letting these guys do what they wanted. She's gone. All right, that's nice. And then might be able to smoke screen this guy. I think we could reach that rank from this position, right? Empowered, emboldened. There we go. All right, that's feeling a little bit better now. And hopefully we can get some more heals done by the end of this. Should be able to get one here for her. Self heal up the dead of night. Nice. Let's bring him to the front, which I think limits his skills too. I don't think he can do his big AoE hit from the front rank. Check in on that. Gen allow to play that and then big damage, baby. Big damage. The slow suffering begins. He can do that from the front rank. Wow, he can only not do that from the back. That's kind of weird. Okay. I kind of want to go with a tonic here. I think it's probably worth it. All right, good enough. Bring that runaway back in a good shape. No shrinking help from there either. Ooh, there it is. Did we get revenge on the librarian? There it is. Thank you, Jax. This is the time to choose has come. An elementary problem, is it not? Double check our skills here. I suppose Dead of Night's not going to do much. We'll go for the absent if we're doing that. We got the ranged moves, we got the iron swan. Got the smoke screen we'll be able to hit him in the third rank with, and then ransack and actually target the back, so that's pretty cool. Let your voice be heard now, man, because I'm gonna let the democracy decide. If you want to play it safe, I'll play it safe. I'm fine with that too. That is all good with me. But we do have some helpful combat items. Did we get the revenge on the librarian? The pole might be disguised, too. You might have the prediction hiding it. Looks like the, the yeses are having it for the moment. I'm leaning toward it, but it seems dangerous. We're also going to lose the road heal, too. Oh, man. It's all of resistance encounters after that, though. Sheesh. Isn't there supposed to be more... Yeah, there's supposed to be more caches in this place. What the hell? Are they all hiding? They must be. That's what this is. These are all caches afterwards. This is my reward for getting revenge. I'm gonna do it. Is your coach prepared for the upcoming obstruction? No. Nor are we. But I'm a fool. And I must honor my my birthright. Of being foolish. What are the modifiers on this flame? There's a way to see that right now, right? Yeah. Enemies are guaranteed ordained, lair bosses are ordained, and confession bosses gain unique buffs. Procrastination of the inevitable. Oh, that's confession bosses. That's not itself. that's not lair bosses. I just realized. Okay, I was confused about that. That's why I thought that the uh, complete catalog effect on the librarian was the new. The library burns. And with it, the remains of philosophy, reason, 
and in sight. Why does she have a 25% damage bonus? Where'd that come from? That's weird. Okay. I'm gonna have to pirouette that, which is certainly a good choice. Because she's pissed, they'll take it, yeah. Oh, is she already meaning no, she's not at the 50% threshold. She shouldn't be anyway. Maybe she was right before the flight started or something? I don't know. Okay. Probably gonna do that. Ooh, max down with Finn again, goddamn. Steady yourself. Mind and stress, okay. Do not want to dragonfly that. Unless I want to pirouette, actually. No, I, I should be doing those move skills more often. Kind of take out take advantage of uh the crocodilian more often. Snap judgment out of the immobilize, that's kinda of weird. Play grenade time. That's going good. That's going good. Now we can dragonfly. Let's move her to the back. Oh yeah, no, that's uh that's not ideal, is it? Whoops. Now everybody's immobilized. Yay! Whoopsie. I was wondering how long uh, the phrase cock and ball torture in parentheses was going to have to be the most recently chatted thing. It turns out it's longer than I wanted. Just woke some people up, I'm sure. Sorry, what bear? I, was, I wasn't really paying attention. What was that? Oh, boy, that sucks. No, you, 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 you're doing what you had to do. I'm not blaming you. I'm just observing. All right, well. We're going to be able to heal that up. Obviously, the shuffling around we've been dealing with here has been kind of weird, but overall, this is going pretty good. Both available to target now. A little bit too much stress on the runaway, but that's fine. Maybe we've got a skill that can stress heal her. Maybe we've got something to stress heal Sal. Or ideally the Plague Doctor now as well. Hyper gets stress heal from that. That's not what we want, so. Bye bye! The work continues. In advance! Yeah, the shuffle's totally fine with us. We'll be able to toe to toe that. And let's see here. Yeah, we should probably keep her up front for now. Oh, blind. I do not love that this is what we have to deal with here. I am pretty concerned about this enemy team. Just this guy in particular, man. He's just always a pain in the butt. But the meal the toe to toe prior was, not, well, was it prior to him getting rid of our taunts. Because this knockback is not ideal. Okay, really glad he. She resisted that. This immobilized. It is still unfortunate that she's likely to be shuffled here, so I think I might want to move her back even further, but I might not get that opportunity before it's too late. Blind's not a big deal. Play grenade's gonna be pretty nice here. Nice stress heal for her as well. Alright. We're in good shape. Turns out better than I expected, and then we can have her here as well. And down to four again. Certainly that doesn't mean her immobilize is gone. Let's do that. The enemy weakens so and land a burn. Outstanding. Lines on blinds on blinds. Alright, so time to start blighting. Well done. No more blind, only blight. She does not have adrenaline rush, so I'm definitely gonna need to do that. This road cannot be walked alone. And then toe to toe. Get the spots back up. That's one down back there. This guy's in pretty bad shape. Miss it? I don't know how you would, but I just was hoping to maybe find a way. Just for the shuffle damage bonus at least, and then let's ransack here actually, yeah. I'm not shuffling these guys around a bit. Knock me back, yeah, go for it, dude. He's gonna be able to self-heal too. Ow, oh, that was kinda dumb, actually. I shouldn't have done that. I should be able to pirouette prior to the toe-to-toe deal. 
should be the case, although that might be another knockback, too. Okay, that's fine. I really wish I could battlefield medicine that, but I'm pretty sure that's a better play. That dude is very nearly dead. I get the... Oh, Absinthe. That's right. We swapped over. I forgot. No dead of night here, but we should be able to heal her up after this. Okay. Excellent. Light's enough there. We're going to go ahead and move back again. I'm going to tell the total locker in the front rank. Get rid of that winded. Deliberate and methodical appliance of harm. There we go. Not too bad. Yeah, I think we're going to be okay here. Hopefully we can both absent and battlefield medicine, although I'm not actually sure if that's going to be medium threshold anymore. It does. Wow, nice. Ooh, yeah. Look at that. Cool. Gaming. And then we might just need a revelry here for a little bit of extra healing, too. We'll see. Definitely going to try to smoke screen this. There we go. That's good stuff. With it. All right. Certainly going to be able to revelry that, though. Get her into slightly better shape. To battlefield medicine again too. This dude is just tanky as hell. Lethality writ large. It's him pretty much done. We should get one more heal off by the end of this. I don't think it's gonna be an actual heal though, but hey, look at that. Nice. Ideal. Okay, yeah, this is pretty much perfect. This is absolutely the condition we want to be entering this fight in. We get the complete catalog, the songbook, the snappy swig. Oh yeah, dude. This is much more much more helpful stuff. Almost accidentally clicked this escape. The conflagration must be stopped. The librarian must be destroyed. Much more optimistic this time, but we still need to rely on some lights landing. I do think that categorize is gonna mess us up a little bit here. It's gonna put the grave robber in the front, so that's gonna be pretty inconvenient, but we'll just have to deal with it. Come on, blights. Come on, Blights. There we go. Good start. That's certainly an ideal target for the smokestack. Who knows what lurks in the beyond? And then what the heck are you gonna do to begin with? I guess you can toe-to-toe -to, -toe to shuffle the round a little bit and also get the taunt up there. Oh yeah, okay, so she's immobilized now though, so that's gonna be way better for us. Okay, so that's ideal. Runaway in the back is definitely not what we want though. We can still poison dart at least, so that's good. A master stroke. Pretty lucky there. Okay. Ransack her back up to the front. Get rid of the line that way too. That's nice. Okay. Let's see. Let's go ahead and get rid of that again. Although, eh, every point of damage I guess matters here, doesn't it? Another blight. Nice. Good dodge there too. Okay, this is going pretty well. It's incremental, but deadly all the same. Sadly, still just not quite the pace we need. I think it's gonna melt that down next turn, which means we're gonna be able to toe to toe into another howling end. But I just want a howling end immediately. Actually, ooh, a crit there is nice. There we go. There we go. Hmm. I don't think I need to worry about that vulnerable token. The blight is beginning to pile up here. That's certainly what we need. This AoE is cause for concern now. Oh boy, yeah, big time. Measure out your violence. I should have had adrenaline rush here. Judiciously. I'm realizing that now. I'm certainly glad we have cauterized. Oh, we're gonna have to clear a dodge as well, which I suppose means I should go for the toe-to-toe. -to -toe. I'm gonna go ahead and do this now. I think that's for the best, and then we clear that. That's a big hit still. Wow, that's surprising to get that much in despite the dodge there. Resisted the blind too. Huge. Okay, we're going to get a uh, battlefield medicine there more than likely. Um, Absinthe is probably smart. And then, ooh, that's, well, actually, I think I'm okay with her position there. We could also do this, but I'm pretty sure this is the way to go. This wound at least has been The tended. blight is already basically gone. That's crazy. All right, I think we smoke screen here. Still have a salve. Nice, got the combo through the dodge. 
Got through the vulnerable Anatomy. there. The burn's unfortunate, but that's okay. Come on, we need a big hit. Uh, let's get sick, Crusader. Don't let me disrespect you, Hellion. I know who you are. I know what you represent. I know what you're capable of. We need some of that right here. I would love that 22% chance to crit and basically bring him down to death's door in one shot right now. That's also pretty good. That helps. Let's see. Hmm. Still think we're okay to do this. Landed another blight there. Nice. We're gonna be able to get the big blight going now from the Plague Doctor, and I think we can go without a heal here. Yeah, the salve still too. Ransack is not amazing, but it is gonna have to be the play there, I guess. That's gonna be a little bonus damage there too. Let's clear the toe to toe again. Which is doing way more damage than I anticipated. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't kill her. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Oh, boy. Okay, okay. Maybe get lucky here. That's not bad. That's a blight, too. Okay. Huh. We'll tell you what. Let's do this. And also the medicine. I think that's for the best there. Extinguished at last. And then this ought to get him to death's door. And then I think we're good. Wow. Oh no. No, 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 no. Come on. Fuck you. Incremental. But deadly all the same. God damn it. Are you kidding me? Oh, Lord. We got another death armor, too. Oh, fuck that. This is no time to falter. Oh, my God. I have a guaranteed crit. I gotta just go for that. The enemy weakens and wanes. Landed the blight. Whoa! Snap judgment, 10% bonus action chance. Holy shit. Holy shit. I guess we do that. I don't know why I wouldn't. Yeah, okay. Oh, that's huge. Another blight would have been much bigger, but... Everyone's alive still. Okay, come on, survive, Plague Doctor, please. Holy fuck. You're not doing five damage, but this death's door, at least. I got. I, oh, boy, I don't know, actually. I think Heal the Hellion is probably the play. It is, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, my God. Plague Doctor's dead. No way. Don't die. Don't die. No goddamn way. Oh, my goodness. That was absurdly lucky. The past is gone. Woo. Let it die. Goddamn. All survived. The loathing abates. Doubters seething. Holy shit. The first in turn order strength token or snappy swig if we can hit 8 speed I'm sure we can find a way to do that but for now I guess we do this Destin Cape would be nice on the grave robber but she can't wield that obviously so oh boy wow that was terrifying man we're still not out of the woods at all a simple choice. At least it should be. We gotta get to that hospital. We need help. I think I should probably go ahead and equip Adrenaline Rush, too. 
here with that iron swan for a minute. They sold you a cursed copy of this game. I, you say that, but we just survived like eight death's door resistance resistances. I think it might be blessed. It's more the bastard's beacon that is the cursed part of this. That is clearly not to be trifled with the way that I have been. Oh, thank you. Yep, I will spend those relics. That is the time to do it. Off to the hospital. No, bar no barricade. Oh, wow. That is a repair fight, though. Oh, damn it. That's worse. We're going to need to heal big time. Hopefully find some healing items in the hospital as well. Mind your wheels. They have nothing left to give. Oh, boy. We should be in at least much better shape. By the time we hit that, but it's clearly not what we wanted to see. I don't think I actually need to heal. But I would like to... Ooh, yeah, get rid of off guard. It's terrible. And then we'll buy some laudanum. All right, yeah, it's good use of the resources. Act two here, Matt. Whispers. Trying to do something a little quicker today, given it's our second run. All right, man. Oh boy. Can you get some bear luck just for an easy repair battle? I know it's probably not going to happen. Yeah, they're ordained too. This is a mess. That's not terrible. That's that's pretty good. I'll take that. Of all the things it could be, that's certainly not the worst. Alright, let's maybe start with the dragon flag. Yeah, let's do a smoke screen here, I think. Keep the vulnerable available on that one. Sadly a repair in the back for the play grenade. Ooh, that's why we got the lot in them, baby. And then let's go for the neutralizing there, too. Minus two pip on that, really? Okay. If you say so. Um, I don't think I need to revelry yet. Let's do this. A huge chunk of the giant's HP. Miss it. Whoopsie! Oh, darn. Another early repair. Okay. It's at least off of the plague... Or, uh, the, yeah, the... How do I always forget the name of these things? Plague grenade, yeah. Whoa, huge stress heal. Let's go. That's huge. God damn. Love the hopeful. It's the crit as well. Oh my god, that was eight stress removed in a single turn. Steady yourself. Go, Plague Doctor. And Dragonfly time. Into toe to toe, into pirouette. Job a gong! Job! I'm so excited for a new cook serve soon, man. Thank you for the 49 months. Looking forward to getting back into CSD. Air hugs, please, for Chubb. Save you from a meltdown. Yeah, that was almost certainly going to be a meltdown there, huh? That's crazy. Uh, let's see. Are we blind again? I kind of want to go for a burn there. Keep her in the front rank. Yeah, that's pretty good. All right, so back two are basically dead. Got the taunt up again there, nice. And I think we're gonna be okay. We should probably revelry after this though. Just to be safe. Bonus stress seal there too, yeah, nice. Pretty good, pretty good. Goodbye. Light up front. Line them one more time. This is the stress heal on Hyper, who is our grave robber, right? Yeah, so instead we should probably just do this just to get the stress heal on the Hellion. And then also do that. And then I yeah. Might even stress heal off the death blow. Did indeed. Good stuff. Oh, we should go back to the um, dead of night here as well. I forgot about that. I gotta get rid of the absent. Bonus damage, toe to toe. Might be able to cauterize that as well. Oh yeah, we're definitely gonna want to cauterize slash revelry here. Measure out your violence. No revelry available and yet though. Judiciously. God damn, her damage is out of control right now. It's crazy. Eh, you just wait. Well, get through the armor. Work. Another stress point heal there. Pretty good. Yeah, get the categorize. Categorize. Get your rivalry. 
my stress point heal. Say goodbye to the giant life. We go we're good. Turn that into a freaking heal fight, dude. No problem. Sweet reprieve. Until the next test is put before you. Ain't no thing. Cowdergerize. Yeah, there we go. You, you found it. Okay. Enough to get another resistance encounter. Torchlight's actually in decent shape. I would like to avoid this, though. I don't think it's worth that cost. This will be affected the one relationship we need to work on. Big focus on the back rank here. Get rid of her. This team is pretty damn good at targeting the back rank. That's been, that's been a nice benefit to these guys. A slow dissection. An unavoidable end. Look at a lot of them, I'm pretty sure, so that'll do here and can easily howling in that guy. See you later, buddy. Oh, that's why the Toda Toad's been doing so much damage. The Ravager benefit up front. Duh. Okay, don't get mad anymore. Thank you. That actually did make the difference. That's funny. She wanted the Laudanum first. Right, clear those guys. Another buff up front. Plus 37% goddamn damage. I'll take it. Seven Blight will kill her in two turns. Another target in the front rank. No sweat. Toad to toe that. That's gonna be bad. That's a lot of burn, man. That's too much burn. Agony by okay. accumulation. Is revelry again? I guess we just do that. Yeah. It does it. Bye bye. Go again. The enemy weakens and wanes. Don't need to heal. Probably well, we don't need to use the lot there, and then let's ransack and get back up front. She's gone, hell yeah. Is it worth it to go Berserk or Hellion to get a quirk with 15% crit? Yeah, the 10% crit from Bleed starts looking really good. I don't know if it's better than Ravager. I mean, I guess it really just depends on whether or not you're going with a Bleed team, right? Because, yeah, like you said, like it's uh, pretty much just a consideration of that. And that's a ridiculous crit chance. I mean, I think the quirk alone... Well, I don't know. I think I think it's I think in that situation you're probably pretty well off going berserker, go all in on the crit. That's a path that I feel like I want to use more too. One that I definitely feel is viable. Crit it up. Man, this is just a, the thing about bastards that I've noticed easily the most begins. is that it just elongates what are normally pretty uh, straightforward and short processes. It turns these into some serious battles of attrition here. You got a lot of HP to get through, man. I mean, the thing now about that crab, you don't have to worry so much about locking in one particular path anymore for the whole Grand Slam because you can pay relics to change the path later on. Of course, if you want to avoid paying the relics, then I suppose you'd want to lock in the one path from the jump, but... you got the option, at least. About the thing about bastards is that they were born out of wedlock because they're not born under the covenant, right? Yeah, the entirety of this squad was clearly not born under the covenant. Measure out your violence and apply it judiciously. Bunch of goddamn sinners. Stun right away. That's pretty rude. For free, you didn't do that. Lethality writ large. A few teams where the mag rain makes sense. I say might want to get a taunt going on here too, but then again, let's just murder this guy. Yeah, that feels better. A promising development. We'll go with that. The good thing about Bastion's Flame is still get all the positive high torch buffs. That's true. Yeah, honestly, I feel like this is one of the more fair ones of the of the new group. 
And like I said before, I feel like it's just more fun to... Although, the ordained enemies is a pretty significant trade-off as far as the fun goes. Well done. Okay, why? Why is that the damage amount? Oh no! That number was way too big. This actually seems like a great opportunity to do these flashing daggers, so let's do that. Just gonna hit them all. Definitely need some heals. Okay, real bad, real quick. I want to upgrade battlefield medicine soon as well. So I can remove DOT on both. Dead. More deliberate and methodical appliance. Still got of harm. taunt up front. Revelry doesn't really add a lot, so let's just go ahead and slaughter this dog. Oh, continues. God, I hope that's the only time I ever say that. All right, another heal there. Nice. One more cauterize for the road. Looking good. Taunt it up, and we are out of here. Bye-bye. Bloodthirsty Ravager. Big numbers. Scavenge what you can, and be off once more. Okay. Swap an absent. Right back to it. Porter. Sure. We got some relics, right? Not at all. We have bobbles, though. Might be able to get a trinket. Ooh, if we can find the greater wolf's blood again, I would be thrilled. It's the rings! It's the rings I wanted. Oh, shit. That's still pretty good. I can still benefit from the relics and bobbles from Dead of Night, too. Man, you can get a lot of those from that. Let's do it. That sounds like fun. Then we can swap over Snap Judgment to somebody else. Uh, and then I'm going to get some death caps for us, too. Those are really good combat items. All righty. You are going to take that. Uh, we're going to give snap judgment to, I guess, Plague Doctor? Sure. And then you can have Smoldering Hymnal for now. That's not bad. And then, hmm. I feel like we're going to want to do... Ooh, let's do this. Oh, wait. Ah, crap. Oh, here we go. Nice. That's pretty good. Ooh, yeah, that's really good for her. Awesome. All right, found it. And then you can have that. No. Well, yeah. Eh, I like the damage. Never mind. We're good. All right, moving on. Another watchtower for another speed bonus, too. That's nice. Gets close to the snap judgment. Ash there as well. Outstanding. Safe route. Good stuff. Feeling much better all of a sudden. It's feeling doable. I think his rings were changed. Yeah, I think that relics and baubles thing is new. I like it a lot. Try to take full advantage of that. Alright, we're not burning anything anymore, so let's just go smoke the screen now. All the blade in the back. Used to be a blight trinket, yeah, which doesn't seem to have any blight effect anymore. A master stroke. Noise. Noise. Good start, good start. Let's get toe to toad. Even still, eight damage in the second rank, too. Awesome. Alright, we got a 
correct targets there. Got a crit now. It's kind of fun. Uh, yeah. Bye-bye. Ooh, and the pull forward on the corpse is perfect, because that means we can go ahead and play grenade that. Just kidding. Nice. That's so cool. Collaboration confers advantage. Ooh, the dodge there with the blight. Good stuff. Another stress point healed. Outstanding. I guess we're only ever going to get two out of the three or three out of the four for the corpses. I'm sure that's still going to add up pretty damn quick, man. Oh, yeah. Make sure we get the corpse created prior to uh, losing our opportunity here, though. Like so. Ah, oh, crap. Mistimed. Misdirected. That's all right. Um... Oh. Yeah. Sounds good. I'll be able to get it still. I'm going to be able to get a rebel right here, actually. Yeah. Heal off that. Reduce the stress points at the very least. Good stuff. Smoke shooting that guy. We did it. All right. Oh, I guess you only get three dead a night per fight anyway, so we're never going to be able to get four to begin with. Empowered. Emboldened. Sneak in one last heal there. Blinded on this hit. Shouldn't be too bad. White will get him. Oh, hell yeah. Love to see that. Bye-bye. Oh, do we sneak into the cauterize at the end, too? Look at that. Wow, perfect. This one Absolutely perfect. Intended to. Wonderful to see. The stress point heal the grave robber at the end. My God, that was outstanding. Amidst the spoils. Wow. An pact of unparalleled power. Ooh, stiff drink adds a blight to absinthe. That's very funny. But that's an outstanding trinket for her. Otherwise, look at that, man. Fully loaded grave robber all of a sudden. Okay. No need for the smoldering handle anymore. And then let's go with. Uh, yeah, I think we'll just leave that on the bench for now. I think we're pretty good otherwise. Yeah, we're healthy as can be now, man. The runaway's got a little stress, but that's fine. All right, grab this cash, some free loot. Get our relics back in supply. Get our bobbles back. Gonna be ready for the end too, dude. Hell yeah. Get some food as well. Outstanding. Your coach is laden. You can carry no more. All right, clearly got some trinkets we can dump, so let's go ahead and do that right away. I don't think I need the slime mold. Eh, I probably don't need the sprawl manac either, but I'll hang on to it for now. She's drinking literal poison. I mean, I guess aren't we all, but a little bit more to the point for her. Do it. Starting with the crit again. A master stroke. I do really like that change that makes it so the great tokens can affect skills like that that way. I think that's for the best. Damn play grenade coming, baby. Blights on, blights on, blights. Stress there too, I guess. All right, we do want to avoid the meltdown there, if we can help it. Crit blind, yeah. Any non-damaging skill has the chance to crit now, and it is affected by crit tokens as well. Oh boy. I'm sure the blight's gonna be enough to get through them before they get their worship off, unfortunately. So I'm thinking I'm probably gonna have to go with like an iron swan here. Ew, god damn it, man, they're really going after her. Oh right, I unequipped iron swan, I forgot. Oh, that's unfortunate. Oh, I gave him a crit too, yikes. Yeah, that's worship time, fuck. That's not good. Oh, that's really bad. There's another crit, though. That's interesting. Let's go for it. Fuck it. 
there's other worship, so we might as well try to stop it. He's got crits and worship all the way up. Oh boy. That sucks. At least they're dead. This, oh, she's in trouble, dude. I might as well just accept her fate. She's fucked. This is gonna hurt. Oh, we have the taunt up, though. Oh! Perhaps they have given Yeah! Wow, I'm kind of surprised she just didn't straight up die from that. <laughs> God damn it. Owie! He's got another crit, too, dude. He ain't, he ain't done yet. Oh, hell. I guess we do that. I don't know. I think the medicine's more important, isn't it? Yeah. Why you gotta be such a pain in the butt? You gotta get these pips all, all about you, huh? Let's try this, I guess. Mistimed. Misdirected. All right, well, might as well do that. He's dead to the blight already. Oh, he's not dead to the blight. Ah, crap. I don't want to taunt there either, but what's he going with anyway? Okay. That terrible I think precipice. I still have revelry? No, I used it last time. Okay, that's fine. There remains a foothold out of this mire. That's still good enough. Now climb. And smoke screen again. Come on critting that. It's working pretty well. Nice blight, okay. Another dead of night, I guess. Might as well. Miss it? Hey, look at that. All right, clutch. Big revelry time. Huge stress heal. All right. Now we cauterize. We toe to toe. At least has been tended to. Land the blight. No problem. No problem, dude. Not a stress point heal. Outstanding. I, I ain't worried. I ain't worried. That's all good, dude. We got a taunt here. Get an indiscriminate science on her. No worries at all. Light going. Stress healing from that again. Get another smoke screen crit. Snappy swig all day. Miss it. Whoopsie. Sorry, pal. We're partying over here. Having a grand old time. There it is. There she blows. Well done. Through the armor. We're out of here. Well done. We have been getting pretty damn lucky with the Death Store resistance this round. Hall. Oh, Put and the Greater Heart use. Seeker. Wow, look at that. We will throw that on the Hellion right away. The loathing whispers. Get her speed back. Nice. Okay. So we're going to have to dump that now, too, aren't we? God damn, we are spoiled for Trinket Choice at this point. No need for idle thought. We ain't going to use that. Last region. Let's knock this out. The Roaring Heart does much for the weary body. Even more, perhaps, for the restless soul. I have an extra big pig, I just realized. Oh, no, no, no. We have one for this region and then one for the mountain. Cool. Oh, yeah. Civilization, big time. The farms and fields of our kingdom overrun with putrescence and rot. Oh, can I go sprawl, actually? No. Okay. So, yeah, that's the way to go. Your coach must be maintained if it is to carry you where you must go. That's why we check the provisioner first. Read a sharpness charm. Although, I don't know, actually. I don't know if it's worth the 50 baubles just to get rid of the gain on miss drawback. I don't think it is. I think I'd rather repair the coach, actually. A smoother yeah, let's ride. Do that. That's for the best. For a time at least. Do I need meditative totem? I don't think so. Anemic's kinda nasty, but I don't think it's worth it for all those relics. Don't need food either. Doing okay with that. Let's see, let's do this first. 
Let's get him their big pig. Nice. Tempted to go with Heli and run away with this whiskey bottle. I think I will. And then let's run it back. Huge. Okay. We could hit him with poetry here to get him into... Oh, they're already very friendly. Nice. Never mind. No need for anything more. Now, we don't want to drop speed on either the Plague Doctor or the Orphan. I'm thinking, actually, we want to swap... Hmm. I think I want to go Snap Judgment on Orphan. Do I? I don't know. This just doesn't feel very good on the Plague Doctor. It takes way too long for this to benefit her. I think it's a lot better on Bonnie. I'm going to try that for a little bit. And then if I do that and then find a way to boost speed via the inn Conventional for the fare, next two regions, but fairly priced. which is doable. I could try either a Blasphemous Idol. I might be able to find a Poultice somewhere. If I find a Watchtower, that's the plus one speed we need. So I think that justifies equipping the Swig. And then... Obviously, we gotta go Wolf's Blood with that, too. 18 HP. Ew. That is before food, though. If I gave her apples and cheese, that's a lot better. Okay. And then these two do not care about speed, so we can give them the goods. You can take the apples and cheese as well. Okay. That works. Listen. Practice. Improve. I think now it's time for Dead of Night. I think I'm going to go with the Plague Grenade as well, because I'm doing a lot of that. We'll get Battlefield Medicine soon, too. Okay. Let's get to the feeder, I guess. Use those bear traps. Time to rob some graves, absolutely. Yeah, that's going to be what we're all about, dude. Dead of Night all day. Not to mention, relationships are Aspiration great shape. The hopeful. Should get some really nice benefits out of this, too. I'm already seen some awesome stuff. Oh, yeah, this is working. While the heart still beats, desire will never die. Respectful on Glint and Dragonfly. Okay. More Dragonfly incentive. Pretty good stuff here, man. Lots of stress healing potential. Heals off Cauterize and Adrenaline Rush as well. Outstanding. Second run of Bastard's Beacon going pretty damn good, man. Now we've pretty much uh, reached the point where it's the negated. The crop grows unchecked and abhorrent. Creature Den is not a bad idea. I think that's a good way to Brace go up. here. There is danger on this path. We're going to need some more mastery points, and this is a good way to try to get them. And then we get a watchtower coming up there as well. No need for the lair. We'll probably avoid that. Maybe hit the hospital at the end, and then we get another cash at the end there, too. It's looking pretty good. I don't believe I've seen any new trophies yet, have I? I don't think so. I haven't gotten lucky with those yet. Right, you can go ahead and get rid of this. I don't even want this thing anymore. I'm not going to use that. Good enough. We've seen the new feeder trophy. Well, we've seen the adjusted feeder. No, that's right. We saw the new feeder trophy. Yeah, it's bad. I don't even remember what it does, but it was it was not good. Yeah, I remember now. Add one blight to self and attacker with your hit. Right. Yeah, that's, that's garbage. A slow Later, Jackson. Thank you for the gifties. Thank you for the mod moderation. As always. All right, Magrain time. Yeah, they changed um, bumper crop as well. Just the more I think about the change to bumper the crop, the more I feel like begins. I might be in favor of it. It was a lot more fun before with the plus 50% HP. But... Plus 50% healing received is a lot. Like, that. that's going to make a pretty substantial difference, I think. Ooh, I just realized this creature den is going to be fantastic for her. Dead of night. We're going to get a bunch of relics and baubles out of this. Can't heal when you're dead. Yeah, that's a valid point. 
But like, just imagine a flagellant like that, you know? I feel like I can get out of hand pretty quick. Variable. Easily resolved. I don't know if I need to cauterize here. I should be playing it safe, I guess. It's a heal for both, anyway. Yeah, it feels good. This is all she's gonna do, dude. This is her entire role from here on out. Just dead of night over and over. All right, she can only do the three, though. Damn it, I keep forgetting, so I can't use the creature den like that. It is good to just get rid of these corpses for these guys anyway, though, so... Good time to use it, I guess. Let's go ahead and restore her haunts here. The work continues. Ooh, this is gonna be really nice, actually. I don't mind getting rid of this corpse, either. Or not. Malaise. Measured and steady. Either way. Alright, so that means nine relics, or sorry, uh... What is it? Yeah, it's six relics and three baubles that we've gotten now, right? Which is awesome. Alright, don't have adrenaline rush here, so I do need to be a little more careful. Oh, I think I do that. Yeah, big time. And then... Telling him might not be necessary, but it is certainly a guaranteed kill, so we'll take that. I'm gonna need a cauterize there, though. Nice. This for 21 at least that. has been tended to. Outstanding. Probably a stun there, yeah. And vexation. Okay, we get the flashing daggers here, which is pretty sick. Excellent oh, poor baby, an excellent flashing daggers with the blight to boot, hell yeah. The fiend's strength dwindles. That's a dead spirit, dude. That was an easy creature death. I'm getting ahead of myself a tiny bit, but I think we just cleared that pretty swiftly. Dragonfly to finish off the scooter up front. Or not. Thankfully, no uh, disease here either. Thing we've got left to worry about, I guess. You got him. Hell yeah. Outstanding. Hopefully, hopefully the big reward here too. We need some mastery help. Greater threats await those who dare. Eh, not bad. Might find a better trinket. Although I'm pretty sure we're good to go on trinkets at this point. The loathing whispers. Don't need much more help there. Everything's good too, right? Yeah, we're gonna get a couple here, but we're going to the watchtower, so that shouldn't be too bad. And then we're gonna get a couple of resistance encounters, ideally, as well. We might hit Lair. The loathing festers. Although I'm obviously pretty happy with my trophy right now. That'd be a good opportunity to get some uh, relics and baubles from Dead of Night, too. Might be worth considering. How are we doing on that? An early pretty good, experiment. actually. Good yourself. And don't stand too close. Heavy-handed Plague Doctor got us some pustule cells for the end game. That's outstanding. Heavy-handed gonna mean it applies knockback on melee. Is your coach prepared for the upcoming obstruction? The speed will, of course, get us into snappy swig territory. Closer to the snap judgment the activation. Lost souls of a dying world. Empty of Maybe. hope. Humanity. Magrain. Oh, he's got the burn with that too, right? Yeah, in our game. Freaking jerk. Combo double burn. Double beauty. He's an easy toe to toe kill. Measure out your violence and apply it judiciously. All right, one down. The dead of night available soon here. Let's just go ahead and make sure the other one's gone as soon as two. Slow dissection. Absolutely. An unavoidable end. Man, damn horror, dude. Yeah, I just go ahead and try Malaise. for that. Nice stress heal up there as well. And steady. Awesome. You like goddamn. Okay, go squad. Two dead up front. The smallest variable. No iron swan still. Difference. I don't think I need both adrenaline rush and 
Rockets Rebel re-equipped anymore. I don't know why I'm still going with that. Can change those back. She's just gonna stress heal down to zero again, isn't she? Holy cow. That was awesome. Much weaker hit there for some reason. Did he have block or something? I guess she was winded. No, she wasn't winded before that. Weird. Look at him being nice and choosing Ren for once. Go ahead and be uh, blinded again there for me now. All right. Fair enough. I'll just crit you to death instead. How about that? Get a couple more relics. One more time right there. No! My torch light, too. You goddamn bastard. A master stroke. All right. One more stress point here. And then just hit him with that. Good get through it there. Good stuff. One more point gone. One more point gone. We're feeling good. Not too bad. Not too bad. Overcome even the greatest of threats. I'm going to be rich by the end of this region, dude. Got a mastery point, too. Let's go. No need for the distracting dust. I'm out of here. So that is two out of the region now, right? Yep. Or would be nice. I'm tempted to go lair on this one. What you got for me? Got an oasis up ahead. Chirurgeon on the end there too. Probably gonna hit that cash though, I'd guess. It's starting to kind of look like just a sort of hug the left situation here. We're going to maintain our wheels at least up through that point. The loathing is going to be an issue. Actually, yeah, I think the loathing is going to force me to go lair here instead of oasis. And maybe even force me to take the lair encounter. Although I don't think we get any loathing of beyond that besides this one, which is cleared by the ingress before that. Yeah, I guess we could do, could do that. Hey, Dunk. That seems like a play. Let's do that. No reason to overcomplicate things here. We'll spend some money for some combat items and some good ones at that. Nice. The loathing abates. Oh! I didn't realize. Oops. All right, let's just go Oasis then. Fuck it. Oh, well. Stronger Psy fight, I guess. Oh, right, yeah, I forgot Iron Swan. Speaking of the seeding Psy. Here we go. We'll be fine. It's fine. They thrill to the succulent flavor that grows up from some nightmare pit far beneath the earth. Yeah, get some spring water out of it, at least. Probably worth a trade. Or not. Oh, okay, come on, guys. Get one spring water out of it. And five flame. Concern it. Alright, well, torchlight's okay, I guess. I'm just looking to avoid that resistance encounter, although I should be open to the idea you of more mastery fight, now. So that others may flee. We'll see what they decide for me, I guess. This hospital is still probably not somewhere I want to spend too much cash. Negative quirks aren't really that bad anymore. 16 relics? Now let's gain relics. By harvesting corpses. That seems better. Okay, start with the please. Let's get rid of the days now. Oh, anemic, right? Get a negative work from the loving, did we? Sickly, tippler, bum like boisterous. I don't think so. It's not always guaranteed. That works. Not bad, not bad, not bad. Steady yourself. Yeah, thanks for hanging, Trid. Good to have you. Sorry, I missed you earlier. Ah, is that gonna heal him? Yep. A 
calculated generosity. She is such a pain in the butt. Is, I swear, it's like nonetheless. any heal that goes to anyone but her, she's not okay with. A slow dissection. An unavoidable end. Okay, that's one down. Sadly, not before that. Ray Robert gets her opportunity, but that's okay. Better she'll be able to knock him out. Oh my goodness, the blight getting bad there too. Sheesh. I'm gonna, gonna need to battlefield medicine that actually. It's at least two down, okay. The smallest variable can make all the difference. Yeah, we know what she's doing. Is this gonna be the heal too? I was honestly kind of expecting her to be mad at that too, just out of spite. Like, oh yeah, now you wanna heal me, okay. I don't want it anymore. I wanted it before, now I don't want to heal. I always want it my way. I can kind of picture run away with that attitude. Wholly disparaging. There's no there's no saving that. Just straight up disrespecting her. Got the blind, got the burn. Let's go ahead and wait that out. I'm not fully anticipating being able to get both dead at night here, but I'll try at least. If you highlight the loathing tracker, it'll show you what's happened, what will happen if it maxes out, but I don't remember for sure. Really? That's a thing? Let me give that a look. That'd be a surprising development. Hey, we got it. Nice. Maximum value. Oh, I did not realize he was going to survive that, too. Whoopsie daisy. I'll take a peek at it after this. In this weighty gloom, Ooh. a spark. Oh, right. That, that accounts for the relics and bobbles you got in there, too. So it does just say the plus 10% max HP right now, but I'm wondering if that's like. If that changes as you acquire loading. Which can take a peek at that too. Let's go! Collector time. Hell yeah. I'm down, dude. There is madness I need the mastery. Pallid cloak. Avert your eyes. Yeah, let's burn him up. All right. Yeah, that's not a burn. I wonder if this would force him to stay in the front. That would be interesting. Oh, all right, never mind then. Lethality writ large. We'll just get all of the DOT in one move. That's pretty sick. All right, he's hurting. Sheesh. Uh, I should toe to toe to start. I think yeah. Ooh, hell yeah, buddy. All right. Don't burn off that. But that's still a great start. Be able to iron Swan after that too. And we have two Tonsa. Or four Tonsa, actually, yeah. Ah, crap. That removes the DOT, too, doesn't it? Oh, that's brutal, dude. That sucks. Not so much for our advantage. All right. Let's get a new one going. Malaise. Measured and steady. There we go. There's that DOT back. Still got our Tonsa up front. Okay. For who knows what lurks in the beyond. Yep. Ah. No blight there either, damn. Empowered. Emboldened. Dragonfly here. Pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. The pirouette wouldn't be all that bad either. Start getting some bonus damage going on these guys. Ow! Okay, I probably need to... Oh, now I don't have Adrenaline Rush, of course. Hmm. Maybe we kill this guy. I am still immobilized here. I can kill the healer. That seems worthwhile, yeah. Now we need a big heal there. Yeah, that works. Cool, we'll get a pip out of it. Oh, that's gonna hurt. Okay. Yeah, that's probably another bleed. Nice. That's pretty lucky. Spear wet works. Damage on them. Okay. DOT's gonna kill the man at arms too. Holy shit. 
Ponta actually pretty convenient there as well. Keeps her at a range range for a minute. Oh, she burns to death. Okay, I was gonna say, don't you fucking dare. Not like that. Not like that. I wanna salve that, but I don't actually think that's the play. In fact, I think I do this. Weirdly. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna toe to toe here. Despite the uh, danger. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's the right play. Actually, let's do that. The fiend's strength dwindles. Yeah, that's way better. We can hit this. Probably still toe to toe. Blight, hopefully, nice. A deliberate. I'm guessing this is gonna be a collect call. Harm. No. Interesting. Certainly helping us out. Okay, and then yeah, that's not bad. Double winded and weakened, and still doing that kind of damage. Oh, no bleed for the cauterize. Unfortunate. Almost salve time, I think. Although I still have ind indiscriminate science, which I can do after that too. Yeah, there we go. And then still do that. Certainly no burn, but that's still pretty good. Heal her back up. Probably still need to toe to toe that too. I have an herb as well if I need it. Really deciding not to bring them back. That's surprising. I mean, I'll take it. I was just weirded out by it. So much for the toe to toe. Let's just kill the dude. Let's just make him dead. Oh, I can't even target him. God damn it. So he gets an extra attack, son of a bitch. I wonder if he's negated being in the front rank at all. That'd be cool. Alright, good fight. Yeah, that was pretty fortunate that he did, decided not to bring his squad mates back. We handled that pretty well, though. Good stuff. Bonus mastery. Might get ourselves a nice the trinket out of that. Gone. Let it die. Tons of loot. Dismiss's head adds execution to ranged skills and adds vulnerable on hit. Oh, yeah. Oh, man. I think I might have to replace one of our grave robber trinkets with that. That is insane. Obviously very good on the Plague Doctor, too. I kind of want to swap off Snappy at this point. That would be insane on her. Oh, yeah. That's the way to go, dude. So that means... Corrupting Cleaver. Oh, shit. That's really good, too. Yeah, that totally works. But then who wants Snappy? Does anyone? I can't imagine we're not using Snappy Swig. That feels ridiculous. I guess we're not. Wow. Okay. Talk about spoiled for choice here, dude. Okay, let's go ahead and slot in some healing items just in case all right man yeah we're good send it off to the hospital we got full road healing right now too stress healed from this joints ache and muscles burn God damn the body requires attention I was gonna say I would like to get a poultice here a stimulating poultice but no luck on that Negative quirks. Anemic, I guess, is one we should get rid of. Bone leg doesn't really matter that much. Yeah, I'd rather just have all these for the uh, for the final An end. elementary problem, is it not? We can absolutely spare the wheels here. Back to the ingress. Yeah, I guess I could have locked in Bloodthirsty. That probably would have been worthwhile. I'm always hesitant to lock, especially because I do like to reset characters so I can get more people involved. But that is certainly a contender for lock-worthy. Oh, y'all are waiting on the Sprawl Gamble still? My bad. That's a, uh, yeah, no one died, right? All shall live, yeah. There you go. I'll do a, uh, I'll do a final, or I'll do a mountain prediction end here too wow instant crits that sucks thank you 
block plus. Hmm. Tempted to try to just. Yeah! One shot her. That's what I was going to say. Do that. Yay! Good God. That's insane. I really like this Hellion. I'm going to get some more relics and baubles out of this, dude. Yeah, that sucks, but oh well. I guess they're the target now, anyway. That blind doesn't really matter, does it? Although, oh, we can miss this, can't we? That's right. Does it still get the relics and baubles? It does. Okay, so that's nice. Doesn't really matter then, I guess. A slow dissection. Yeah, another crit there. I don't think that matters either, An though. I'm sure that guy can't crit. Although, oh, no, he probably can now, can't he? Because of the uh, patch changes. So let's murder him before he gets to do that. Hooray! Okay, we're definitely going to cauterize this. There's a little heal on the Hellion, too, which is nice. He's gone. And methodical appliance Yet another apart. dead of night. Thank you very much. Still a full. That doesn't really matter. I think we go ahead and toe-to-toe -to -toe again and make sure she's locked into this. Hell yeah. One more down, and then let's do that. Horrible chance. Malaise. Beautiful. Measured and steady. Heal. Probably colorize that again. Big heal from this. Ooh, huge heal from this. Full heal from this. God damn, dude. And our last dead of night. Perfect. This is just textbook now, man. A breakthrough. She just resets the vulnerable. Holy fuck, that is crazy. Goodbye. Tommy. Tommy's got something to say about this. Tommy's pretty thrilled with the outcome, aren't you, bud? He just got to get propped up real quick. There he is. There's Tommy. In all his glory. Can I get a side angle? There he is. He's loving it. Adios. We're off to the end, my friends. The past is gone. Let it die. Grab these. Get going. I want to run. Oh, right. Yeah, I thought that was the last one for some reason. Now we got a couple more notes. The road ahead is washed out and strewn with rocks. Mind the wheels. Oh, that's cash, actually. And then that last oblivions. Which one's scarier, Exemplar or Tommy? I think I know the answer. I just wanted to make sure. The loathing whispers. Let's see. We're saving these. I'd like to use these at the end here, too, actually. Let's go ahead and do that. Bear traps as well. Nice. Need for that, no need for that. I think I am getting rid of these two, which seems absurd to me, but I'm pretty sure our trinkets are good to go at this point. No need for additional cash scouting now, and let's get rid of the. Uh... Jeez, everything's really good at this point. I guess the herbs are the worst. Tommy joins the reaction streaming crowd. We should get the react streamers to react to Tommy. I should just make this a Tommy channel. I think he's, he's got far more growth potential than I ever will. Turn Tommy into a VTuber. There we go. All right, buddy. Sorry, I got to get this water. Oh, look at that. He's standing on his own. He's so, he's so strong. He's a strong, independent Tommy. You don't need no stand. Right, it's chapter two. There's no exemplar. Yeah, I didn't, have, I didn't have anything to be worried about. Cool. Okay. Well, let's just get to it, I guess. One down. Basically. Oh, that helps. 
Thank you. That's just, that's a give him a crit. Combat items is what that one is. Give him some vulnerable too, huh? Holy shit. Hold fast. For who knows what lurks in the beyond. Oh yeah, dude. Plain vulnerable, that's alright though. Wow! Oh my goodness. The blight and the burn off of that, that's awesome. We have the plague doctor up front now, unfortunately, but this is a pretty good spot all the same. Steady yourself. Jesus Christ. Okay, this is getting kinda nasty actually. Let's get the hell out of here. I'm gonna toe to toe this. Get her out of harm's way. Come on now. This got real bad real quick. Not be able to cauterize here either, so I suppose we'll just go ahead and do that. Malays. This for dead. And, then and steady. This one we have a double blind on him too, so hopefully we can get lucky with that. Nice. Heal here either. We just go ahead and take a big chunk. And then we're gonna get the battlefield medicine on the runaway and feel a lot better. There we go. That's more like it. And we do this. So we're able to get another cauterize off at some point. Go ahead and take our last relics in the bottle. Might as well do that. I was gonna say, hopefully, no AoE hit. It's a little bit too much to ask for, I guess. Toe to toe again, aren't we? Yeah, I think it's probably adrenaline tonic time too, just to be safe. Actually, this revelry we can ourselves out with the stress a little bit. Ooh, speaking of which, yeah, that's pretty effective. Okay, another vulnerable token there too, and then we just get a nice big smokestack, smoke screen. And sure, why not? Well, wow. That was a lot more damage than I expected that from Poison Dart. Now to be Death's Door, nice. He can vulnerable blind, he's in bad shape. That'll do it, man. Holy shit. See ya. A master stroke. One last heal for the road, maybe. One last revelry possibly as well. I should probably try for that. Just stall a little bit here. Just shuffle around a little. Medicine. Oh, he's got it. All right, under the do it. application of violence. Good enough. Fields. Morbid gains. Let's wrap this sucker up. Yeah, no, thank you on the cruel intent. You can keep those. We're off to the end. One last rest. The loathing abates. For redemption. Let's do it. Haggard, tired-eyed, all are welcome here. That ahead of myself, I'm gonna go ahead and set up some last round combat items here. Those are looking pretty good. We've got some excellent stuff for the seething sci fi, too. The place is a little worse for wear. Ooh, and Cosmic Slayer. But familiar nonetheless. Don't mind that one bit. And plus three mastery. Holy shit, dude. Okay. We are gonna be well suited the for the fi finale here. Journey awaits you. Once again. We got full repaired stagecoach, get the wind chimes in there, because why not? Your academic instincts. Got sir, good food well. here. Outstanding. Oh baby, and look at this. We can get a sharpness charm too. Holy shit. Plus 20% damage. Might as well do that now. Yeah, let's hit it. And without that drawback. Outstanding. Alright, we're gonna start off with the songbook here and go into a big pig. Let's go with the Book of Creative Insults up here, and then Stitching Kit, we might as well go ahead and get these guys up. Precious don't think we need of a time before the end. any fancy foods. We can go ahead and give those heals to those guys. Boxing gloves we want on Runaway Plague Doctor. And then Big Pig is gonna finish them all off. Fantastic, we'll just use the poetry as a stress heal. I just to make sure they're all max affinity. Need nothing. Yeah, we're good. Good to go. Sick. And just whiskey for fun. All right, no need for relationship stuff anymore. Let's go ahead and take a songbook or two so we can make sure we're meeting the speed threshold. 
Snap Judgment is very close to getting the positive token added already, so let's just go ahead and take that second one as well. Where is it? There it is. A bit of comfort on the road to damnation. And then we just buy all of the buffs at this point, but let's get mastered first. One learns quickly when survival demands it. We're going to get our poison dart. We're going to get ourselves a pick to the face, possibly, is a worthwhile co consideration here. We're going to upgrade our flight. We're going to upgrade our magrain. Well, magrain's less important, I guess. We'll take the smoke screen upgrade. We'll get a searing strike. We'll get our dragonfly, possibly. I don't think I'm going to be using that all that much either. So we'll take the wicked pack. We'll take the iron swan upgrade so we can get more damage in the back rank. And Absinthe. Because we're going to be swapping Dead of Night for Absinthe. Okay, cool. Good stuff. Last set of upgrades here. Let's go for the dartboard for the crit chance. Holy beads, blasphemous idol, whetstone, the of the road. clarifying poultice, speed bag, and uh, we'll probably do it. Get some glimmers too, and thunderclap. Why not? Cool. All right, get all these buffs going. We want the speed. As much speed as possible on our Snap Judgment Bonnie. So we'll give her the Blasphemous Idols along with the Holy Beads and hope we get lucky there. We absolutely did. That's outstanding. Snap Judgment is immediately amazing. Boom, boom, boom. Shake the room. Bear roll to victory. It is that time once more, ladies and gentlemen of the bear pile. We're going to need as many bear rolls as we can muster as we approach the foot of the mountain once more. Single fight separates us from the seething side. So we'll pop these glimmers right away, hoping for some really nice positive relationship interactions here. I'm certainly anticipating it. Aspiration unites the hopeful. Should be good, baby. And thank you for getting the mountain prediction going as well. Appreciate it, Pawn. Oh yeah, it's all looking nice. While the heart still beats. Desire will never it's die. It's all looking nice. Get those bear rolls going, man. You know, I might even use control burn I'm now realizing. That was one I kind of forgot to consider upgrading, but I think we'll be good all the same. Let's hit it. Off we go. At last, the great ziggurat. Temple of failure and regret. Oh, yeah. I think, I think we are more than prepared at this point. A successful go, or... At least uh, looking like a successful go here with the Bastard's Beacon. Which, after that first run with it, I was not anticipating any level of success. But sure enough, we have found our way back to the mountain here. See how we handle our first Oblivion's Ingress. Behold, the infinite emptiness of the void. Stealth start is fun. Let's do it. We have the glimmers, Bonnie. But apparently, I'm mistaken. A master stroke. She does have the snap judgment instantly, though, which is a lot of fun. Thunderclap grenade start as well. I like quite a bit. We're gonna get ourselves a rush judgment on her right away. Not to mention a whole bunch of dot and a stun on the altar. Hell yeah, baby! Vulnerable tokens. He is hurting. That's too much stress. I don't like that. Bet we got some skills that are going to restore it. Let's start with this. Leave the boy on bare optimal to begin with, huh? How about that? I'm going to be able to kill this altar before it gets the bonus out. Dragonfly looking pretty damn good. Execution! I forgot! Oh, shit. A promising development. Oh, that's fun. Might as well use that. Another stun. <laughs> Holy shit. And uh, you know, we need more relics and baubles, clearly, is what's necessary at this point. All the relics and baubles, please. We gotta get rich. All right. Got that last glimmer. Maxed out. On our torchlight. She's gone. A deliberate and methodical. Back to back stuns on the far. altar to stop him from even doing a damn thing. We're out of here. See ya. Should have used that spring water at the end, obviously, but I'll take the this world, easy W. Wealth is worthless without purpose. And the rare relic reward for that fight. Now. No need for death cap spores, I guess, either, I just realized. 
We're gonna get that in there, and then let's get the War Horn too. Yeah, that's a good one. Really good combat items to finish this off. Swap the Dead of Night for the Absinthe. We're ready. Bear roll. Let's speed run the side, dude. I think this is gonna be easy. The nightmare gate. Easy peasy. Is revealed. Beyond only infernal nihility and non-existence. Defeat doubters in shambles. The seething sigh. Stertorous avatar of ill-concealed rage. Right, so obviously we're kinda hoping to see some front lung inhalations. Lethality writ Nice large. damage there. I love to see it. But we are going to be able to Iron Swan this, so we can depend on that pretty reliably. Assuming no blind. Right, and that's why we like the taunt up front to begin with. Okay, that's good stuff. Uh, speaking of taunt, let's go ahead and do this. Apparently the Runaway is going to be our primary tank for this fight. A little DOT going early on. Wash in turmoil. That's a lot of burn. I probably want to be a little concerned about that. Let's just go ahead and pustule that immediately. And then Iron Swan for the win. Oh, that requires 12 and I hit it for 11. Okay, that stinks. And there's the rear lock again. All right, so let's be aware of that, I guess. Let's see. I suppose, well, I can't ransack either, so let's try this. That was pretty lucky. Wow. Didn't get the burn, sadly, but that was great. Let's try to add another. Oh, let's do the Warhorn, actually. This would be a great way to guarantee the Iron Swan gets through. Blight there. Nice. Okay. Don't have to worry about the winded here. Big chunk off the rear lung as well. Good stuff. Probably want to heal that, especially if I'm going to noisemaker again. Yeah, let's let's take care of her. We could do this too, but that's a, well, I should have done that and then done the noisemaker, but that I guess wouldn't have really mattered all that much either. She's got all the blocks, so don't have to worry about that. It's, the stress is becoming a bit of a factor now, though. We got another rear lung inhalation. Okay. Do I want to try this blind again? Probably. Just gonna be blinded over and over. Ooh, the snap, judgment, bonus action. Burns through those. Alright then. I suppose I could be doing play grenade here. Oh, that's vulnerable to the lung too. Right. Interesting. Tempting to go for that 23 of 42, but it's nice to take big chunks out of the lung as well, I guess. Let's get some more light going there, hopefully. It's starting to pile up a little bit. Yeah, goddamn, dude. This bonus HP on this guy is pretty noteworthy, too. 420 hit points is a lot. And there's the meltdown as well. How about a quick little resolute for Bonnie, huh? Thank you. I'll take it. I'll take it. Full stress heal. Full heal. Back in business. Get another rear lung. No more tokens she has to worry about. Good stuff. Resisted, unfortunately. Absinthe not quite able to heal yet. We're probably gonna have to do that soon, though. This is yeah. no time to falter. Yeah, I need to heal now, actually. Okay. Oh, I do have another pustule. I might want to do that instead. Hmm. I already cleared the lung. Do I want to gamble on that? I don't think so. Let's just do. We could do this, actually, but this feels safer. Now let's just push. We'll sell that. Let's help her out a little bit so she can make sure we get the light in there. Okay. All right. Let's be smart about this. Still can't ransack. I'm pretty sure she's just going to be doing this all the fight. Relief comes rarely in these times. Savor it. I'm really unlucky with the burn. Still invulnerable in the back. Nice dodge there. Okay. Let me go ahead and hit this again. A 
41 damage on the long. Holy shit. This is beginning to feel like it might be another situation where I just want to get rid of these things. Oh, I didn't realize that was a, death, a deep breath, too. That was... That was a mistake. Oh, it was front lung. That's why. Oh, fuck. I, I thought it was a deep breath. I didn't pay attention there. Nine for four. Yikes. Let's do fix that. Extinguished at last. Oh, boy. This is bad. Hmm. Oh, wow. Watch bonus action there. Okay. That's good. I think Absinthe is the way to go. Agony. And we're going to be able to... Iron Swan this still. We can get another Pustule in there, but I don't know if that's necessarily the play. I think it is. She just has to do this, right? Yeah. Because there's no taunt. Okay. Huge. Huge. His rings adds the combo, too. Wow, that's big. Still vulnerable back there. I'm actually kind of thinking... Oh, no, no, no. Yeah, we do that. Unlucky with the crit, though. We got the blight, at least. Take this hit, right? Yeah. Oh, baby. Little combo action. Got the burn there, finally. We're, like, halfway through. This is, this is insane. It's beginning to feel more and more like I'm just going to destroy this. Certainly appreciating the vulnerable tokens here. Oh, look at that. Wow, that was sick. And taunt up front for the Book of Creative Insults, too. Okay. Look at us go. Come on, Seer and Strike it, I guess, man. Sheesh. Still no burn from that. I bet no weaklings. That's amazing. Good light, nice. Keep going with the play grenade, I guess. I feel I shouldn't heal until it is absolutely necessary. Oh, yikes. That stops the Iron Swan. That's really bad news. Fuck. I don't want to immobilize either. I might just have to move forward, but that, that feels even worse. Oh, god damn it. God damn it. Alright, we're gonna have to target it with other things here. This is really, really bad, though. This might be a meltdown, too. Oh, no. Oh, God. That knockback just completely screwed me, dude. We were doing okay right until that moment. Sweat-soaked brows. Unsteady stances. Exhaustion Front takes lung. Over. Okay. That's something at least. Dragonfly is not going to do much, but I think we got to do that so we can pirouette. Yeah, the loathing's really starting to hurt now, huh? Alright, that is the lung cleared, I believe. Oh, it's like one away. Ah, oh, God, dude. Unfavorably rounded down. That is so unfortunate. I think that's GG. Yeah, that's probably GG. Might as well try to clear the lock. Wow, really? And now I must be a single hit point away from having cleared all. that. I can't believe that didn't do it. Damn, dude. All right, well, good try. It was. It was literally all came down to that long. Or not that long, the uh, the knockback. That knockback did it all on its own, dude. That is that is brutal. Let's do our best. The fiend's strength dwindles. I'm not dealing 130 damage here, but I'll give it a try. 
by a plague doctor. Nothing can survive such a wholesale, organic failure. 17 and 13 are the new thresholds on Bastard's Beacon Lungs. Oh, man. I didn't even realize. Yeah, that's what's going on, dude. Oh, crap. I didn't even think about that. And I absolutely should have. Yeah, that was that was the big difference for sure. Crap. This is no time to falter. Oh well. Yeah, we were on our way there too, man. It looked like we were gonna be destroying that back lung in this fight. Which would have been huge, but Oh well, decent effort, especially with the buff boss as well. I'm happy with it. Another wound. Try again next time. Another loss. Important lessons learned there, though. Try and try and again. a newfound respect for the bastard you beacon. Will break through this All right. Murk. We got to wrap up here, though, because we got to move on to our next thing we're doing. But thanks a bunch for watching some Darkest Dungeon 2 today, y'all. Leave a like on the video if you're watching over on YouTube.com slash Appreciate all the support over there. We'll try again with the bastard's beacon next time.